Good afternoon, everybody. How you all doing? God, it's even great music in this. Like, it's very epic music. Which, considering we, we just entered space for the very first time, well, for the third time. <laughs> you haven't closed the window? <laughs> I'm having a blast. I am, I am loving this game. Hello, Saitama. Why am I do this? Hello? In just beginning. Well, we actually played yesterday as well. Um, so you haven't... Well, I guess depending on your knowledge of the game, you, you may not have missed much. Literally only the first planet. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm glad I waited um, until... Um, like, like, obviously it's had patches. I guess it was buggy when it first came out. Starting for the day, yes. Yeah, just literally starting right now. Um, I'm surprised I missed it, though, because I'm a huge Fallout fan. No surprise to anyone. Uh, and this is, this is fantastic. I feel like... Um, speech checks are a little bit broken you can get away with literally everything <laughs> well so far hopefully that changes but um yeah that's my next focus is speech very fallout mass effect mm -hmm. yes yeah, spot on uh less mass effect it's the story's a little bit less serious i think but there's definitely parallels as well zoe what do you want Yeah. I don't care. All right, let's uh, let's jump in. I don't want to wait any longer. Should just load the last save, I guess. Yep. Right, so we are destined to head towards the... Oh god, what was the name of the ship? Burr, 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 burr something? Not sure. Groundbreaker, there we go. Scylla. Grouping of rocks known as the Charybdis Cluster. Toggle inactive quests. Oh, we can go to Phineas Lab? Let's go there first. Weapons from the Void. Yes. Yes, indeed. Oh, look at that. Welcome to the system map. All the planets as well as some special points of interest that you may have discovered. You can fly your ship to any location that you've unlocked, though some landing bays require special codes. We learned about that yesterday. Arriving at Phineas's top secret orbital lab. Okay. Oh, and then we choose uh, an, a companion. Well, it's got to be Kaylee. I mean, sorry, Parvati. All right. <clears throat> Hello? Can you hear me? Does this work? Oh, damn it. Blast, that's loud. 
Yeah, it works. How can I help you, sir? I'm just here to collect the weapons and then I'll be gone. I sold all my food, right? We're only down to 113 from 160. Oh, jeez. I gotta scrap more of this, I guess. I'm assuming weapon scrap doesn't weigh much, or if it does, it weighs a lot less than the weapons themselves. Okay. Well, I'm just securing my ongoing experiments and securing myself. I mean, securing yourself. Mind the mess. Uh, I haven't had a visitor since. Uh, in fact, I've never had a visitor. I was actually going to comment on the mess. That's Bubbles. Bubbles doesn't want to talk to me. Bear. Tell me I can put those posters on the ship. It'd be pretty dope. Obscure body in the SK system. As a reminder. D hibernation experimentation notes. Feel ridiculous telling mostly frozen slab of meat you're doing fine, queeb. Practicing bedside manner important aids recovery. Hello, physicist. How you doing tonight? Can't wait to awaken more of from hope. Study in detail. Is it even right to call this effect brain damage? Seems like an enhancement to me. Who wouldn't want an on-call on hyper-fast cognitive response? Am I envious to expand the span of a, breath, a breath to an eternity? Hmm. I envy you, Queeb. Interesting. We're uncovering motive here. Potential motive. Uh, I'm doing good, dude. Yeah, having a great day. It's, it's Friday. Ugh. Liquefied remains of Sisty Pig. Um, my afternoon lunch, I guess, um, consisted of, have you ever had those Nutrigrain bars? Nutrigrain's a, a, a Kellogg's cereal that I used to have in Australia. I loved it, in fact. I wonder if they still make that. Either way, they, um, they sort of co-opted, the American Kellogg's company co-opted Nutrigrain into these um, bars, like uh, lunch lunch bars. What do you call them? Like... Kind of like, uh, not, not oatmeal, but you know, that kind of thing. Breakfast bars. And, uh, I had about four or five of those this afternoon. <laughs> They're really good. <laughs> I don't know why they call them Nutrigrain at all. Like the, the, the outer layer, the, the shell of the filling tastes nothing like the breakfast cereal at all. Password SWH eighteen nineteen forty two. 
Sending my new accomplice down to Hawthorne via escape pod. As soon as the revival process is complete, Hawthorne should make for an agreeable companion or at least an acceptable chaperone. Reminder, 14. Remember it this time, absolutely vital. 14, 14, 14. What's with all these scrapped bots here? And more to the point, why were the contents not recovered? Pocket watch, interesting. I worked it out. Explain details later. Will be difficult to reproduce. Need your help. All necessary materials should be present in Halcyon, but locations elude me. Dumped a new associate, Dirtside Terra 2, near Edgewater. They have a stake in my purpose, but trust them only about 23%. They're recovering a ship, should be along any time, just need to know where to send them. Something not right going on here. There's a there's a bigger story at play here for sure. Sealed. So we can't get in to find the dude. There's the shrink ray. Wow, that was quick and easy. Science weapons are unique weapons that have strange and powerful effects. Science weapon damage and the strength of their effects both increase as your science skill is increased. Uh -huh. I see you found my portable molecular compression device, better known as a shrink ray. Find the target, point and shoot. The target will shrink down. I mean, we got to test it, right? Okay, so science weapons have that sort of back background. The Apple logo. Genius Bar logo. Let me bust down some of these. These are garbage weapons anyway. Uh, heavy? No, we're going to stick with our rifle. Loaf, please. Daddy's streaming. Okay. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, I'm doing actual damage to them as well. Sorry, bud. The label said shrink ray, not hurt ray. Of course. 
what's on your mind? Never know what being frozen did to your brain. There's always a chance you might turn violent. Violent? I've no desire to end my top soon. Regardless, it's quite comfortable in here, you know. I have my beans, have my caffeinoids, plenty of toilet paper. Absolutely. Let's talk. No, and I've been trying very hard to avoid making eye contact. Nice to meet you, Dr. Wells. I'm Parvati Holcomb. Wait, not another word. I don't want to know your name. I don't want to know who you are. Let's just enjoy our plausible deniability while it lasts, shall we? Why don't you just invite the entire colony to my secret, carefully concealed laboratory? It isn't as if I wanted privacy. Oh, very well. I can be a little cantankerous when I haven't had my caffeinoids. You have my apologies and so forth. For what it's worth, I am pleased that you found a crew such as they are. I picked you out of the hope for your talents, after all. It's only mm. natural that others would gravitate toward you. Yes, indeed. Well done. Also, you still haven't spontaneously liquefied, which pleases me immensely. Progress. on your mind hmm I got an oogie feeling all right well I think we've done most of what we can here something ain't right something very fishy going on So that's his ship, which looks like it's still damaged. I actually like the design of that. It looks like it could be a uh, real world. Hmm. Hey, DT. What's up, man? I was going to... Uh stitch you today and sort of <laughs> my dog's getting in trouble <laughs> he's still biting um make it make a tiktok today but I, I didn't have time uh i have acquired poster right so i'm assuming that's something i can put up in my room question mark or somewhere in here How much do you want to upgrade my rifle? Uh, Tinker? Oh, insufficient money. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, we're broke again. Shit. Okay. All right. Well, on to our next location. Oh yeah, yeah. No, I was I was gonna say that you know there is a positive side to to you know what we were talking about before. So we're gonna go to the groundbreaker now. We've arrived at the groundbreaker. It's what I just said. Let's talk when you're free. Hey, Captain. I heard that Groundbreaker's got a real good engineer. A lady named June Lay Tennyson. I was thinking that maybe I ought to meet her. If you got time to swing us by, I mean. I don't got much experience fixing actual spaceships. I bet you a can of Borston beans she could teach me all manner of stuff. Thanks, Captain. I'll be sure to make it worth your time. Did you want to talk about something else? 
Oh, you stopped me. Hey, Xpeel, how you doing, man? Just checking your ship's manifest. Standard procedure. How about not checking anything about my ship? Nothing to hide there. Can you, uh, you see me over here? Nah. Freely walking around with uh, a rifle, no sweat. This hack was just knocked out one of my workers. Yeah, with a toss ball stick, I heard you the first time. There weren't any witnesses. No witnesses? He's not even denying it. Now's not a good time. I'm dealing with a problem here. So, go space yourself. Problem solved. Wow. You must really want to truncheon through your teeth. Do what you want. I'm done here. Whatever you heard, it's all true. I had this foreman, right? Guy never liked me. Always trying to get a rise out of me. But I keep my chin up, right? Be the bigger man, I tell myself. He's a spacer's chosen man, though. So when the chosen beat my rangers the other night, my foreman comes swaggering up with his head full of boasting. That's when I broadsided him with a toss ball stick. Yeah. Look, this was a long time coming. Guy thinks he can push me around because he's some sky-high foreman, and I'm just a back bay's dock worker. Well, former dock worker. Guess I just tendered my resignation. Enjoy my freedom. Scrounged together enough bits for a zero G. Other than that, can't say as I do. Hey, not for nothing. But I saw you wander out of that ship over there by the dock. Wouldn't happen to be yours, would it? Captain of the Unreliable. You're like something out of a serial drama. Hey, I don't want to talk to yours <laughs> off. I've got places to be. I appreciate your time. <laughs> Felix Millstone. Pleased to make your acquaintance. See you around, boss. Going for a stroll around the docking bays? Violence, my man. Going for a stroll around the docking bays? I'll have you join me before the day's out. We mean steal zero G. Well, I guess it might belong to somebody. Hello, Stevedore. Careful where you smoke. Crew bills us for air filtration. Nah, no sweat. What do you need? Oh, nothing. Wait, who just stopped me? Him? Felix? What do you care? Nope, nothing going on here. Can I help you? That's what I thought. Yep. Nah, you're good. Yeah, if this was Fallout, it'd be like, ah, oh, your your companion disliked that. It's like, well, oh well, you're gonna have to put up with it. I do the crime because I'm not gonna do the time. You learn to keep your eyes to yourself, in my. If it wasn't for us, this whole damn station would shut down.
Thank God they don't have advanced technology like security cameras. Oh, we got wanted posters. Hell yeah. Because they're bad at pathing. They're good to have though. Um, I had the melee guy. God, what was his name? Strong? Really good. Well, that was in Fallout 4. But you're not wrong about pathing. No, that's definitely uh, something that wasn't really taken into consideration. Proof of kill. Sedition, forgery, conspiracy. Conspiracy to commit a conspiracy. <laughs> Station would shut down. What you uh what you doing here? Taking notes on what posters have been put up? Alright, let's buy some heavy ammo and sell a bunch of shit. That is of course unless the customs guy's gonna take everything off me. He may very well do that, actually. Heavy. Identification, please. Captain Hawthorne, you said. Let me apologize in advance. I'm about to ruin your day. I'll kill everyone on this Before platform if I have to. You've been flagged by the board. Your ship will be impounded until such a time as they see fit to lift it. But we've hardly been out of Edgewater long enough to get in trouble. Now, hold on. This isn't the end of the world. Probably. No, not, not this... This plat, th this, ah, you know what I mean. Oh, thank the law. I could use a diversion. <laughs> Tell me more then. Really sell it to me. Not fond of that story. You lacks dazzle. What else have you got? Please, you can do better than that. Where's the drama? I like where this is headed. What happened to this uh, vile kidnapper? You must feel terrific. Good for you. Not in the least. Good story, though. Not stuck, per se. You could always throw yourself out the airlock. Of course, then you'd find yourself with an exciting new problem. Access to that information is above my pay grade, and I've turned down three promotions, so it stays that way. <laughs> I shouldn't be mentioning it, but what the hell. This here, impounding your ship, it doesn't happen much. The board knows we don't take kindly to their interfering in our operations. If I had to take a guess as to why... You probably riled up the wrong petty board bureaucrat. Man named Udom Bedford. Bedford. Not gonna lie, you're in a pickle. But uh, Udom's an uh, interesting guy. Might be y'all could come to accords if you play your cards right. Huh. Records show this ain't the first time your ship's been impounded. Seems to get cleared up pretty quick. You might not be in this pickle for long. Oh, and if you're headed that way, would you mind doing me a favor? Wanda Dorset over in sick bay. Tell her the shipment's not in yet. It's not coming in anytime soon, and if she'd be so obliged to get off my ass about it. A handful of Sam cleaning units retrofitted for surgery. I don't know much else. I stopped listening when she started yelling. Much appreciated. Is there anything else I can help you with?
fence. You'll find her in the rest and go. On your left when you enter the promenade. Make sure you bring an empty belly. Most places are on the promenade deck. Big door yonder, straight through security. There's a bar on the starboard side. I got a preference for the Lost Hope myself. Talk to Vera. She'll set you right. Uh, Thomas, this is my first playthrough, so I don't actually know what the answer to that question is. Um, somebody came in yesterday saying that, oh, yeah, it's a really short game. It's not worth it. Uh, I spent seven hours on the first planet, so you tell me. You need anything else? You let me know. Don't want anyone saying Groundbreaker is not the most hospitable port in the colony. Maybe. Most of the shipping traffic in the system passes through Groundbreaker. Every couple of months, we even get a big interstellar freighter. Two biggest operations are the board. That is, Halcyon Holdings and Sublight Salvage. But there are independent operators around the promenade deck. Most of those jobs are going to take you off station, though. Fair. Are you pulling my leg? You must be one of them long-haul freighters from outside the colony. Well, I won't hold it against you. It goes like this. Back on Earth, before the crossing, the powers that be were selling off stakes in distant star systems they thought had potential. A bunch of companies decided to throw in together and form the Halcyon Holdings Corporation, then buy up the rights to this here colony. That group's what we now call the Board. Groundbreaker was one of the original colony vessels to come over on the crossing, a few years before her sister ship, the Hope. Once everybody'd been dethawed and dropped dirt side, the original crew of the Groundbreaker decided they rather liked the spacefaring life. I guess that was the start of our independent spirit. Now, here we are. Uh, I'm really enjoying it. I think it's I think it's great so far. Um, I I had the base game. I don't know for how long. Never played it, um, and then yesterday I picked up the two DLCs before I started. Not that I think we've seen any of that content yet. Yep. Groundbreaker's the only real independent port. Aside from us, there's just tramp freighters and wildcat miners. Seems like every year the board's offices get bigger and their ships take up more of the landing bays. Haven't seen nearly as many tramp crews this year. Sitting around drinking whiskey and smoking cigars, yeah, probably. Can't say for sure, of course. Doubt I'll ever see the inside of it myself. Glad to help. They strip the parts from derelict ships and abandoned outposts. There's some that say they make the derelicts and encourage folks to abandon their steads. Sublight gives me the creeps. I've known folks who went to work for them and just vanished. They're on the promenade run by a woman named Lilia Hagen. I'm only telling you so you know to avoid them. This guy's giving up a lot of information. <laughs> Sanita might have a couple of folks she needs killed. Bad folks, I mean. Not, uh, not regular folks. She'll be at the security desk behind me. Chief Jun Lei might have an errand needs running. She's all tied up trying to fix our heat problem. You'll find her in engineering. No kidding? I'd love to get a look at this old girl's innards. I bet they're real twisty and weird. In a good way. If you're thinking to make a career here, don't waste your time. Full-time jobs on Groundbreaker tend to be inherited or go to a fellow crew member's kid. Keep it in the family, you know. Relative to the board holdings? Not really. But there's a few with the means to go where they will. They aren't rich, but they aren't likely to look too close at your work history either. All right. Um... Udon Bedford. He's friendly enough unless you speak ill of the board. Get the sense he doesn't care for ground So Udon was also someone we could report. Board man and all. He's our liaison. Our rescuer too. Really likes his cereals too. Maybe a little too much. Bit of a weird bird all told. Don't see what's so wrong about liking cereals. They're fun. Udon takes it to an uh, unhealthy level. You noticed, huh? What can I say? We're passionate folks, and the board can't abide that independent spirit, especially not when it might impact their bottom line. All their interstellar freighters come through us, 
and we skim a few bits off the top and manifest processing fees with every one. Folks around here will bluster that the board hates our freedom, but really, they know we can stop their out-system shipments anytime we like, and that terrifies them. You mean the heat? Sure, we can make them fix it, but what would they do in retaliation? They got assault cruisers, gunships, and a handful of mining operations at their fingertips. We push them too hard, maybe they decide we'd be better in 10 trillion little pieces. Or they cobble together a new groundbreaker and put us out of business. The board wouldn't do that, would they? It's a tough line to walk, no doubt about that. But we may do all right, so far anyway. Okay. Sure thing. Be seeing you. Unreliable business unknown. Impounded Hawthorne ship, but no Hawthorne. Wonder what happened there. All right, so they know. not the smartest move. I picked up this weird signal the other day. It was coming from Monarch. Hmm? Here we go again. No one huh? lives on Monarch. Move along. You huh? Things. Hmm? No, seriously. A lot of static at first. Restricted then... access, authorized personnel only. Ran? Well, come on in. Right. Come on. There we go. Alright, we're gonna save the game right here. Unauthorized personnel in restricted areas were shot on site without question. You can either fight, sneak, or use the holographic shroud. Oh yeah. I have the holographic shroud, right? Um... How do I even activate that? I definitely picked it up, right? Hopefully I didn't scrap it. Maybe it's not armor. Uh... Okay, so we have it. How the hell do I use it? It's a quest item. Hey, that's impressive. Get in here, god damn it. Come on. Fine, stay out there then. Confiscated goods. Modified pistol, hatchet, metal hoop, prayer beads, locked container, owner refused inspection. Hawthorne ship impounded by order of Udom Bedford. Still no clue. 
why Hawthorne associates with the bored snake. Well, he knows exactly who we are, or at least not who we are. Are you on patrol, or are you all going to face that way, I wonder? What's that noise? All right, that was a mistake. Load game. So I'm going to go do the same thing again. A little bit of XP for opening that, and then just want to read these notes. Go back. Okay, so we've got to be quick about it. Here they come. Open fire. Fuck. Ah. All right, all right. No way, insta, insta scene. Well, I guess we can't do this then. At least we know how that works. Must have been the wind. Yeah, I figure that's important information. Maybe. Okay, we're good. Purple berry punch, you're damn right. There is a way to, um, I think it's with a perk, there's a way to determine whether or not somebody has like stuff on them before you search them. I'm just in port long enough to get another hall contract. Or maybe it's the contents of lockers. Maybe it's both. You saw nothing. Rizzo's fetch your water after drink the rainbow. Rizzo's Lemon Slap. Slap your whole family tonight. Jesus. Hey look, it's the guy wearing the moon head that I had. Well, sorry about the heat. Chief Tennyson will get the radiators fixed soon. Of course, this heat sure makes a zero G brew extra refreshing. Mm. It's an ailment. Good for what ails you. Oh, 
And it's not the best choice, it's Spacer's choice. Taste the freedom. What a slogan to keep track of. And sometimes I forget. Uh, have a look. I wonder if there's something very unique that we should be able to buy or, or that we should be looking for specifically, I wonder. Have you tried our dehydrated water tablets? Just add air. Don't take my word for it. See for yourself. Make a choice. Spacer's choice. Spacer's choice. Heard of it. My orientation aether wave showed that famous Saltuna cannery. Which I'm sure smells as good as it looks. If you did, that'd be good, actually. We could use the help. I'd have to go over my contract, but... I don't think I'm allowed to leave Groundbreaker. Or this stall. So, what can I get you? Some soap. Everyone loves soap. Everyone will love you for using it, too. <laughs> I'm bound to satisfy headgear-related inquiries. Please send any complaints to our Consumer Care Headwear Division. Oh, I'm having a stellar day. Uh, not just because I'm legally obligated to say so. Almost as stellar as a spacer's choice is affordable. Uh, I can see all of the top quality merchandise in the spacer's choice catalog, which is available here <laughs> at a reasonable price. All right, moving on. Well, I guess we better look at your inventory first. Defective Moonman helmet. You can't just steal stuff from a shop, though. Not stuff that's on the shelves. That would be stealing. Stealing from other places is not stealing. You can't keep me out of there. Please don't make a scene, Dr. Fenhill. I'm sorry. Am I causing a scene? See, Umforo? We could have avoided all this unpleasantness if you just let me talk to Jesse in the first place. Let me get one thing straight. Jesse and I are not friends. I just owe her, okay? As for the rest, I'm trying to figure that out. All I know is that she's been here too long, and she's apparently not receiving visitors. Be my guest. If you know something I don't about dealing with hospital bureaucracy, I'll be impressed. A quest objective requires you to enter a restricted area. If caught inside, you'll be shot on sight. Using a disguise will prevent immediate hostilities. That doesn't seem wise. But whatevs. That's my restricted access right there. You found an ID cartridge to use with the holographic shroud. You will now be automatically disguised when entering an associated restricted area. Let's save game. Yeah, it's almost like they want me to try it as part of some kind of... Oh, what's the word? Tutorial on how to use the... Holographic disguise. Moving drains the shroud's energy. When it runs out, personnel will see and interrogate you. Talk your way out of the interrogation to reset your shroud. 
It will get harder to talk your way out the more you are interrogated. Okay. That's it at the bottom. Oh my god. Oh, that's Parvati. Oh my god, it works remarkably well. Stims. Oh, hello. I like it. And it resets just by leaving an area. That was a hell of a firework. Fourth of July started already. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't be crouching, huh? Pro noob, how you doing, man? Just a casual grenade launcher sitting in a uh, box in a hospital, no big deal. She's worried about you. Should have known she'd send a bruiser after me. Damned if I don't rue the day I saved her scrawny little hide. Inadvertently, I befriended a bloodhound in the process. All right, okay. We can discuss this like the level-headed folk that we are. Seems I've got to do something before Ellie goes jabbering my business to anyone with one ear and an intent to listen. you're doing wait what ah sorry for the misunderstanding I guess I guess that's it oh okay the unlocking of the door confused me. Alright, let's head back then. we we'll still got to talk to Gladys, I suppose. That's good shit. Why would you throw it away? Because I stole meds? Maybe. But I couldn't talk to her after the fact anyway. What do you think you're 
doing? Sorry. Uh, nothing was going on. Oh, my mistake. God, everyone's so nosy. How do you do? And uh, welcome to the rest and go. We used to be the go and rest, but folks never knew when to leave. <laughs> Sorry. Business has been slow. Anything to occupy the time. Oh, you can't miss her. Right behind you, number two. First unit on the left, or second unit from the right, depending on which direction you count from. First unit on the left. Ordnance control armor. Defense skills. 29 armor? Oh shit, that's pretty good. It's not bad for 600 bucks. Mind you, I only have 1700 total. Hmm. Nope, this is a bathroom. Not Gladys. Bless my heart. A stranger come knocking on a poor old woman's door. You here for a particular reason? Or did the neighbors tell you how good my sugar cookies are? Made without a single natural ingredient or an oven. Just like store-bought. Those have been the height of illegality since Stellar Bay turned their noses up at the board. You and I could be thrown to the void just for discussing such a transaction. Lucky for us, Groundbreaker's a free port. We're outside of the board's control. For the time being, at least. Now, I only have the one nav key. And they're hard to come by these days. It won't be cheap. If you find yourself lacking in the bits, mm, shit. I might have an opportunity you'd be interested in. 10,000? Fuck. <laughs> Phineas, that old kook. He was quite the dancer back in his prime, did he tell you? Real light on his feet. Real light in the wallet, too. He still owes me a small fortune. Laws, maybe I should charge you double. Well, I find I'm in need of a ship captain with a little more of flexibility. Might be this could help out the groundbreaker as well as earn some bits. But if you've got qualms, do you know Edna over in engineering? Sweet as a pea, that one. On occasion, she'll pass along transmissions I might find interesting. She sent me a What's up, Hayden? Stress signal she'd Happy Friday, my dude. Calm array. Curious thing is, it came from an outpost called Roseway. And Auntie Cleo abandoned that place years ago. You've got an ear for intrigue and a nose for bits. I like that. Here's a copy of the SOS recording, complete with the coordinates. If you should find a secret worth selling, might be I could find a buyer. Corporate bigwigs will pay top bit for inside information on their competitors. Hmm. The more we got the corpse fighting each other, the less time they got to meddle in our affairs. Don't forget to come find old Gladys when you're done. Might want to acquaint yourself with Junlei Tennyson, Groundbreaker's chief. She's been trying to get a handle on this heat problem. So we got to go to engineering. You'll find her fretting in engineering. I'd say she's a sweet girl, but law for fen someone call me a liar. I found a handsome ceramic manda pillar at a salvage auction last week. Did I just level? I think I just leveled. Um, why can't we buy this stuff? Restricted stock. Hmm. Okay.
Stealth kit. Increases stealth skills. Oh, okay. Alright, well. I certainly did. Uh, we're going speech, right? Sneak hack and lockpick is, well, soft capped. As is that now. Tech, I guess, is my next. And then, yeah, go for long guns or, or heavies. Perk next level, level 10. So, quests. Um, hmm. Talk to Jesse. Groundbreakers. Med Bay. I was supposed to talk to her, god damn it. Uh, luckily, it's not fire. I'm not there we go. But if you repeat what I'm about to tell you to anyone, I will deny it with my dying breath. You uh ain't with the board, are you? See, I owe them a lot. I might have missed a payment or two, and the other night I swear someone was following me back to my room. So I hold up here to lay low. What? No, I didn't do anything. I'm a law abiding denizen of this ship, I swear. Think? No. I recognize a contracted killer when I see one, thank you. In my line of work, that's a skill you develop during week one, assuming you want to keep breathing. All right, I'll fess this part up too, if it means you'll help me. I'm a thief. I specialize in particularly high-end and historically valuable items. Three weeks back, I caught rumor that the blood tear diamond, last worn by an heiress <coughs> on the Lost Hope, had surfaced for the first time in 70 years. If I had, you'd think I'd be hiding out in the med bay. I was gonna steal it, lined up Udom as my buyer. He paid half up front to finance the operation. Let's just say things went sideways about the time I got my hands on the diamond. And it crumbled to stardust in my palm. Anywho, I barely made it out with my life and nary a plan to make back Udom's deposit I'd spent. Udom Bedford's the board guy on the station. He'd know how I stand with them. If you can square things for me, I'd owe you one even bigger than Ellie owes me. Thanks for helping me with the board. You're a real pal. Or I guess I should say, Ellie is one, huh? Okay. Uh, let's head over to engineering then. You've been following that series? The Hunt for the Wimbro? Sprotwurst vendor. Hmm. Auntie's kitchen key card required. How the hell do I get out of here? If 
you're hungry, you've come to the right place. I've got a fresh ground batch of Spratwurst cooking. They're terrified to lock in the juices. How about a grinder's dozen? Fresh from the grinder, any hour. See, sometimes escape, it does take you back out. Other times it doesn't. That's why I keep, uh, oh, that's a giant door there. Keep accidentally pressing it sometimes. Junlei Tennyson. I'm captain around here, but chief to my friends. Hope you don't mind the formal introduction. Groundbreaker doesn't see many visitors. No, it isn't. It's a mess, but it's my mess, so I'll take the compliment. Just so we understand each other, I'm the final word on the ship. The Mardix, the crew, the engineers, their family. I hope there won't be any problems while you're visiting. Good. Don't go making trouble, and chances are you won't find any. That's how I like it here. So what brings you to Groundbreaker? I'm curious, even though nine times out of ten, the answer is just passing through. Interesting. The powers that be paint an ugly picture of Monarch. Critters and such. Maybe someone in the promenade can get you the right weapon for the job. We see a lot of the same faces coming and going. Most of them board spies and corporate brats. Makes it hard to trust outsiders. You seem different, so welcome aboard. What? Well, I didn't think you just... Parvati, is it? That's a lovely name. What can I do for you? I was just thinking, I haven't got much experience working with actual, real spaceships, Miss Junlei. Uh, uh, Chief Junlei. Junlei is fine. Um, okay. Since you run a whole space station, I was wondering if, well, maybe you could teach me some things. I could message you later, maybe? I'd be happy to make the time, Parvati. You can ask me anything. Wow, great. I I'll do that then. Messages. Later. Oh, your, your name's pretty too. I should have said, sorry. I like it. <laughs> Honest. Sorry. Couldn't have done it without your moral support, Captain. Now, if there's nothing else, there are other parts of the ship begging for my attention. Groundbreaker's radiators need replacement parts. They're dumping superheated air into my ship. Only the board has access to new parts, and I won't let them swindle me into a corner. None. Every time I give in to the board, Groundbreaker loses its freedom. Soon there won't be anything left. I can't allow that. The board isn't helping, and my resources are spread thin. If I don't get those radiators back online, Groundbreaker, everyone aboard, will be cooked alive. Reasonable, huh? That's the best news I've heard all day. According to my grandmother's old schematics, the parts we need should be in the back bays. Back bays. Sorry, I forgot not everyone knows this ship like I do. The back bays are on a lower deck, long abandoned, and a haven for miscreants now. Sounds like combat to me. Good. Once you've obtained the parts, we can proceed to the next phase of repairs. I like that there's a heat shimmer everywhere. That's cool. Junlei, do you want to face the opposite way, maybe, by chance? Like, just face over here, real quick. Oh, look! There's something on the wall over there. I'll be back. I'll steal that. This is Halcyon News. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following story. Hey, that's against regulations! Hey. What do you all right, all right. You got me. The heavy ammo, though. They come. 
All right, settle down. No need to kill everybody. All right, all right. Sorry. What, everyone's after me? What the fuck? Come on. <sighs> An extreme way of dealing with thievery? Well, you get one chance. Second chance, not so much. I actually want to see if I can... Maybe, maybe break into here. Boy, what do you think you're doing? Ah, oh, nothing. Do what you want, I guess. There you go. Get in here, fuck. A death wish or something. I was never in there. You saw nothing. And you will see something. Unless I'm over here. You're lucky. All right, so we're going to... Let's go back to the ship first. Then we'll go... Why am I still allowed access to my ship if it's been confiscated? Or impounded, rather. So, Anna, thank you very much for the raid. Welcome on in. I hope you're having a lovely day. Uh, yes, drinking Saffir one, return to the unreliable. Go back to Byzantium, you gold plated bastard. Talking to me? Nope, nothing stolen here. It's Captain Sticky Hands of Yeah, see we can't return. Hey there, you mind stepping back? This charming little ship's been impounded and I'm afraid I can't let you near it till it's not. Gosh. I wouldn't dream of it. Not unless I got to, and I don't see any reason why I'd gotta. Do you? She's a good ship, ma'am. Mostly doesn't act up at all. Happy to hear it. I'd surely love to, but that's just not my bailiwick. You'll want to have words with our representative... Bailiwick? Mr. Udom Bedford. His office is on the promenade. Bailiwick. One's sphere of operations or particular area of interest. You never give the presentations. That's my bailiwick. I, uh, I may be using that on a resume from, from now on. No sweat, Joanna. Thank you so much for stopping by. You take it easy. I'll see you again soon. Pleasant day. Yeah, you're lucky. Hmm. All right, so we can't access my ship at all. Currently locked off. Meaning I can't do anything further with that quest, so we might as well get the heat thingy back online. Salvage parts, which should mean combat, like I said before. Rico, purple berry, 
That's in the elevator. Going down. From above approaches our realm. Back away now, or you'll parley with the king. Look at this ripe piece of meat just sizzling on the grill. Huh. Yum, yum. Time to feed the flames. Nothing personal. Promise. Oh, you shouldn't have said that. Is this what carbon monoxide poisoning looks like? I don't think this deck is too well ventilated. You came with the crew. Welcome. We got plenty of space to spread out, but only room for one captain. Ooh, look at the courage on this one. Lay it on me, boss. Give me a taste of that fiery primal spirit. Right, sir. Just the parts. We'll be in and out in a jiff. You won't even know we were here. Tennyson just keeps feeding the furnace, don't she? We're still playing with her last sacrifice out back with the crew. You don't just ask a king for a favor when you're standing in his court. You bring tribute, sacrifices, prophecy, shit like that. Under its skin, this ship is all poison and darkness. Lead bones, asbestos muscle. Maybe you're right. You've got the run of the kingdom. Up those stairs, you'll find the parts. My crew won't get in your way. I thought you'd play along. Lay it on me, boss. I'm good for it. Ship got impounded. The crew and I racked up a debt while we were grounded. My baby got sold to Sublight. Scrapped for parts. That's bureaucracy for you. Piracy with a smile. Am I your dark reflection? Shit, must be getting old. Stay here too long, and the groundbreaker drains you like a fuel tank. You can come and go in my little kingdom. Just try not to piss off any of the gestures. See, I'm kind of addicted to experience as well, though. It's called the XP points. You wouldn't understand. I want that weapon, too. Okay, I died. I'll be retreating this time. I wonder if I could just straight up take his weapon by... Nah, that ain't gonna work. Maybe, 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 maybe. What do you think you're doing? Not quite. Think you're doing. God damn it. Nothing to optically here. Incoming.
Medical drone, yeah, right. Might have been some kind of exploit available there with the constantly like getting caught using skills to dissuade them or persuade them. Thousand XP a piece, hell yeah. All right, let's check this dude first. Where is he? Montag, yep, there's his weapon. Hundred and fifty ammunition left. Yay. So Montag, I don't really want this. Well, at least not yet. What the hell is that? Uh, I'm sorry. Did we just get raided by Hyper Stifer X? What's up, my dude? Happy Friday to you. How you doing? And welcome in everybody else. Great to see you. Doing great, my friend. Doing very well. Having a nice day. I'm not stealing everything and murdering everyone. Um, so, you know... Going pretty well. Nice work. Palm Top Pitbull, one year on the clock. Thank you very much for the resub. Did I say not murdering everyone? <laughs> I'm so silly. <laughs> um. Loving this game, by the way. If you haven't played this one and you're into Fallout style games, it's really good. Having a great time with it. That's the thing I need. That's the thing I need. Wait, do we show her the body count? She'll be even more impressed. Spiritual success at New Vegas was same dev team, right? Well, some of the same people that made up made up the dev team for New New Vegas Obsidian Entertainment. Plasma rifle. See, now you're talking. That sounds good. Look at this thing. Oh, can I can I use that? Scrap mechanical. Nah, fix it right up. Uh, how's your stream, Hyper? What's uh, What did you get up to this evening? Are you still playing... Don't tell me, don't tell me. Um, Remnant? Something, something from the ashes? I think I briefly popped in the other day and uh, yeah, my, my biggest frustration and one of the reasons why I stopped playing Remnant was the... You have glowy rocks in your room, sir. Um, the starting zone, the, the whole starting area was... What do you think you're doing? Don't let me catch you around here again. Oh, what? Two years of affiliate. 
Holy shit, dude. I had no idea that was even um that was even a thing. I I would have been there had I have known. I'm sorry, my man. That is amazing. Congrats. Um Wow. Two years of an affiliate. That hits. That hits a lot. I'm sorry. Um, well, congratulations. I wish I was there. Uh, I would have definitely uh, enjoyed your company tonight. And Ordinary with the resub at Tier 2 for one year. Thank you, my man. You're all absolute legends. I love you. Junior Mycologist's Log. I hope we didn't kill the mycologist, because uh, we need more of those people on on the planet. McCred just set a man on fire for having his laces undone. Shit, shit, shit. Maybe I need to be more careful about what I'm growing. <laughs> Time to experiment. Hey, you can do all the mushrooms in the world if you want. It's there's nothing against that. As long well, as long as you're not a hundred meter runner in the Olympics. Let's just uh Let's call that one a wash, you know? Current and controversial. Plasma cutter. Okay, we're good. Um, I'm actually coming up on... Two years streaming in... Eighteen days. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe, maybe I'll do a 24 hour. Who knows? Who knows? Um, but yeah, going back to uh, uh, Remnant, I, I really wanted to like it because it's like a Souls shooter kind of thing. It it puts things together quite nicely, but then that starting area was just so dis mm, distracting and disheartening, and I got lost every time I went in there. Hello, Malganus. How you doing? I think we're done in here. Took care of the, the trash. So where are we going now? We're going back to the engineer. Right. This is Halcyon B. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertising. You've returned, and in one piece. Mm -hmm. Color me impressed. And all the stuff I've got, completely legit. Purchased it myself. So I don't even worry about it. Good work. I'll take those. I need you to head through the large door at the far end of engineering. Take the elevator down into the machinery shaft. There's a terminal in the back. Activate it when I call over the ship's PA. And bring weapons. There's a slight manticore infestation. Don't worry, Miss Junlei. We'll be super gentle with the ship. You don't got a thing to worry about. I love her so much. I mean, aside from She's so cute. She's like, totally... I'm genuinely heartened to hear that. Thank you. She's, she's so smitten with this engineer. It's cute. Level 10. Hell yeah. Speaking of engineering. Uh, this is my fifth and final perk from this tier. Faster sprint speed. Science weapon size. Eh. Weapon durability loss. Eh. Fast travel when encumbered. Pretty good. Nah, we're okay. What do we got next? Movement penalty to accuracy. 
Reset it. I'm not even using companion abilities. I don't really care. Science weapon damage. A lot of science stuff here. Consumable weight. That could be pretty good. 40% or oh, sorry, 40 kilograms carrying capacity bonus from companions. Ah, okay. Tend to dialogue skills. When you have no companions. I might end up going solo. Because of this skill right here. All skills plus 10 if no companions recruited. What if we currently have some? Can we eject them? I mean, dismiss them from the ship? Quiet weapon damage. Vendor buying price. Ooh, I like that too. Yeah, for now we'll take that. Movement speed. Alright, so we need a different sort of weapon here. And I need to sell, I think. I've got... Oh yeah, I'm right on the limit. Sell time. Let's go back to a vending machine. Uh, vending machine, vending machine. Actually, any any vendor will do. You look like someone who's taken their share of cuts and bruises. Need some armor? Maybe it's a bit secondhand, but that's only a testament to its durability. We also have a line of specialized melee weapons. No sweat, Hyper. You take it easy, my man. Have a good sleep, and uh, I will respond to that message as soon as I can. Take it easy, man. Oh, what's this? Officer's spine. Aramid ballistics. Bleed effect. Now I have fireworks. It's not even the 4th of July yet. God, just keep your dick in your pants for a couple of days, please. Thank God it's not, like, awfully hot and dry, because... <laughs> You know, I'd, I'd hate for a fire to start. Why can I not buy these? I thought I... I thought I had access to the restricted stuff. Maybe that's a higher level of restriction. We've got a 29% discount here. I don't know why. Anyway, we selling. Uh, let's sell all that. Let's sell all my food stuff. My personal right to shoot fireworks and set fire to the entire state cannot be infringed. Yeah, I mean, this is America. We're up to three, three grand. Melee weapon attack speed, Adrena time, all attributes minus one. All right, give me... First of all, let me repair my primary weapon, which does nothing. It's currently at 90. Well, it's because it's pristine. That's fine. That's fine. Buy. You're not selling ammunition. Why? Why do you hate me so much? Oh, Pavardi leveled up. Range damage. Chance to extract mods in the field.
Yeah. All right, let's break down these. Oops. I probably get rid of most of these. Auto mag pistol. Uh, that's actually significantly better than that. Let's break down most of the stuff. Dead Eye Assault Rifle. Now we're talking. Probably needs a bit of work. The upgrades that I've done are like really expensive. Where's the weapon, the named weapon we got off the dude? Shot cannon. We got so much light ammunition, I need to use that. I'll keep one of those. Shrink ray, plasma cutter, light assault rifle. 180. Alright. There's my light ammunition taken care of. Bolter pistol. Energy weapon. Nice. Oh, it's Montag. There we go. Heavy. A lock-on flamethrower. Did she come for a visit? Oh, she wanted to come out. See Daisy. Oh boy, why does the camera look so orange? Oh well. This is Feora. My second daughter. Yep, we're soon to get a third. Ms. Queeb is expecting. <laughs> I love her belly scales, yeah. Congrats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're getting two more snakes. One boy, one girl. Hopefully. Yeah. The girl is, is we're definitely getting the boy is a question mark at the moment because he hasn't had any meals. Don't worry, Faye. I won't let the fireworks get you. No, that's totally cool. Absolutely. Um, yeah. Some people, when they come in and they see the snakes, they're like, "Ew, it's so gross." Oh, I hate snakes, and those people get insta banned. So, you're cool. We appreciate the response. No. Yeah. 
Yeah, she's getting bigger. She's she's only what four hundred. Not even. So she'd be just under four hundred. No. Oh right. Three three fifty to three seventy five. Uh, Huxley, on the other hand, is well over five hundred at this no. point. Six hundred. Oh, she's got me. She's got me. Yeah, I'm gonna stay here now. He's massive. Well, we're not overfeeding, so. That's right. Yeah, he lost a ton of weight during his last shed because he was in there for so long. And, but his, his books were different. Yeah, his coloring is definitely changing. I'm sure you have to pee. Miss Faye, you gotta wipe your butt. She's beautiful. Thank you, Miss Queep. Yeah. Got my thumb. Eh. Oh, she she's not letting go. I'm trying to work out why this camera is so uh orange. Oh, that's right. I unplugged my headphones by mistake. That's better. Thank you, Zach. Yeah, looks good to me. Yeah, she always has a tough time going through shit. Um, cause she banged her head on the. Ever since then, it's been problem problematic, right? Silly thing. Okay. So let's get rid of. Uh, these are the same. I'd love to see randomized stats, right, for the same weapon types instead of them being identical every time. Yeah, whatever. Let's keep that there. Actually, let's swap that for that. There we go. Uh, break that down. Break. that down hold s flip sort s sort name value cell value 496 for the shrink ray what that's better Although this one, oh, okay, so this one has an upgrade on it, that's why. Yeah, I'll just, I'll just sell whatever's cheap, and then let's check the armor. We've got a whole bunch more armor here. 
And we've got some special ones. Again, let's sort by value here. Engineering plus five. Ah, we're good. We don't need any additional stats, really. We should probably just go for fashion souls instead. Tech plus five, tech plus five, medical plus five, leadership skills. Um, I guess some of these might allow us entry into certain locations. I just don't know. Oh, there's the defective one. Temperament plus one. I'll keep that because it's uncommon, I guess. Dialogue skills plus seven. Ordnance control, 16. Lockpick max. Distance plus 2.5. See, now that is something worth keeping. Riot control. Marauder armor we'll just get rid of, I think. Don't need two of the same. Spacer's Choice, Spacer's Choice. Alright. My lying skills are... Ah, perfect. And we do now have a second slot for... Consumables, that's dope. How much do these weigh? They do weigh. Okay. So we gotta maybe store these somewhere once we get back to the ship. Do these weigh? Yep. No, they're zero. As his weapon parts and armor parts. Nice. Alright, I'm happy again. What's the damage on that? It's going to be pathetic, isn't it? 180 versus my assault rifle, which is three double. 360. Well, I have to use it because we've got so much ammo. Alright, where are we heading? Sorry. I don't mean to keep shooting everything. going down I assume we're going down looks like it huh well you got in that elevator quick Pravati idea about why I flew us here. Mantis Swarm? Oh, shit! Okay. Another one somewhere. Where are you? Up above? What the hell, man? Yeah, that's exactly where it was. Come on. No. Why are you even hiding? You're a grub. No Manta swarm. Okay, well, we now have a new type of enemy. What the f- Come on.
All right, so we've got a bunch of mechanicals. Oh, I'm getting, okay, flame damage from the engine parts. Because it's hot in here. Maybe I can reprogram the bots again. Oh, he's actually quite a tough one. Light ammunition does not suffice. Combat drone down there. Mechanical Guardian, Mark One. down. Who's shooting what now? How'd you get downstairs? Ow. Bard. Boy, did I choose the wrong direction to go. Uh, hello? Unbar that. I assume. I have the parts in position on my side. Go ahead and cycle the droplet pump. And if you don't know what that means, just look for a command. Cycle droplet pumps. Fix radiators. We fixed it. We did it. Groundbreaker owes me thanks. <laughs> no, no, no. You must be mistaken. Groundbreaker owes me 10,000 bucks so I can buy the key card that I need. That's what Groundbreaker owes me. I'll keep using my light arm, my light, uh, light ammo. So I wonder if it's even possible to stealth that section at all. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Temps are lowering across the station. Anyone outside is getting a hell of a light show from the droplet arrays. Thanks for the help. Let me know if you ever need to borrow a wrench or something. Repairs are holding just fine. I was going to ask to borrow a wrench. Oh, workbench. Um, can I repair? Yep. Repair all. 
equipped. And repaired that. Cool, everything's repaired. This is Halcyon News. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following story. Toss Pearl Finals are scheduled to air soon, but it's sad. My boys are returning to green. What a weight that is off my shoulders. I don't normally tolerate outsiders mucking about in my station's guts, but you're all right. The temperature should be dropping as we speak. I'll see to it the crew knows who kept us all from boiling alive. If you've got time, I believe Edna has a comms issue. 18k. I've also authorized Doc and Furu to sell you our premium meds. There we go. Frustrating. Everything down to the circuit boards is past warranty, so I have the pleasure of making life or death decisions on a shoestring budget. Groundbreaker are now There's agreeable. No to train my successor or document fixes in a way that anyone outside the family would understand. Sure is. The Tennysons came over on the Groundbreaker. My grandmother, Chief Gein, kept it together during a crossing and until she died. I was promoted only recently, when my mom died. Then I took the leap from chief engineer to captain. They must have been amazing people to have taught you all you know, I mean, which is a lot. That means a lot coming from a fellow engineer. It was different knowing that I couldn't turn to anyone who could answer the tough questions for me. Maybe you can see why I'm protective of Groundbreaker. This ship is family. It's got tinkerings and bypasses that only Tennyson's know about. Oh, gosh. I don't know. I'm really just a, a dab hand with a wrench. Nothing special. Not like a chief engineer. Don't sell yourself short. It doesn't take a seasoned pro to tinker on Groundbreaker. Just someone who knows how a ship ought to feel. We're always thirsting for help. If you can find your way around this labyrinth of ducts and panels, we could work something out. <laughs> I don't know if I want to... I mean, leave her to her dreams, I guess. She wants to work on a big ship. That's cool. I hope that was a joke, Captain. I really do. Relax. I yelled at that thing years ago. Now it brews a stim that goes down stronger than Nana Spank. Family recipe. You got my attention. Okay. So what's the next quest then? Weapons from the Void. Acquire the science weapon on Groundbreaker. Gladys shop for old records. Uh, yeah. Been following that series, the hunt for the Wimbro. Gracious, I was just sitting down for tea. Yes, dearie? Take that darling ship of yours down to Roseway, where that distress signal I told you about came from. Right, so we can't do that yet. Tasty mm. corporate secrets for old Gladys. Shouldn't be too tough for a fellow like you, I'd think. Want a charming copper kettle off? It's almost time for today's episode of The Chairman's Children. Care to listen with me? What do you want then? My hard earned wisdom? How do I get That's right, dear. hold? The well, I gotta search around this room, I guess. That's us. Though for how long, I can't say. That all depends on Miss June Lay. The board can't abide a community that won't bend to its will. Hmm. 
Another of Hawthorne's log mentioned looking in Gladys' shop for old records. Apparently the smuggler acquired several leads that way. Well, that's probably it. We gotta save the game here, I'm afraid. Shit might not go according to plan. Oh, you've got to be in the front of it? That's a bit rough. What if I was on top of it? Ah, uh, he can see me. Oh, maybe he can't see me. No, he definitely can. What do you think you're doing? Nothing. Found a new flaw in you, paranoid. Repeatedly getting caught by guards has made you jittery. Personality attributes, minus one. I could look that up. Personality means charm and temperament. We get a perk point instead. Hmm. Here they come. Stamp is used to place the official seal. All right, so this isn't where we're meant to be. Steal any more trucks? I I don't know what you're talking about. Um, give me one sec, folks. I am gonna go get another drink, and we'll be right back.
Thanks for waiting, guys. I had to make my uh, very special concoction. You wouldn't understand. It's a southern thing. And they don't get any more southern than me. As you were. Mess with Gladys, you mess with us. Yes, Melganis, the nuts and cola thing. I, I mean, I choose root beer, obviously, but same, same thing. been through here I have been through here interesting I found that but not the other one so where where is this thing it's telling me to talk to Gladys for the other weapon episode of the chairman's children care to listen with me want a charming copper kettle off that girl who runs the pub she's a fierce arm wrestler but she's no match for your pal Gladys That's nice. Uh, I think we can do better though. Six shots, so you get three bursts. I might as well buy those if they're quest items. Was it? Hawthorne's terminal. Oh, 
Hawthorne's terminal. That's taking me back to my ship, I think. Does me no good. I can't get back on the ship. Still sealed, right? Yep. I'm just going to try this. Sorry, is that an invisible barrier protecting my ship from me? Yep, it certainly is. They're too clever. So now we have to go and... Well, there's only one thing we can do really, right? Distress signal. Play it on the ship. Solution vital. Corporal Wheeler at Groundbreaker Customs asks you to update Dr. Dorset in the sick bay. Let's do that. Mm -hmm. I got it, Lewis. I'm doing side quests first, or as many as I can. Sick bay, sick bay. Big door. Can't say I've seen you before. I take it you're a freighter, Captain? If you're here to better yourself, you'll have to wait. We're having a spot of trouble with our delivery service. Did he now? Mouth on that man. I swear his late mother'd be ashamed. He must be referring to Erion. I'm sure the fool's gotten himself into another scrape. I'm beginning to wonder if I'm ever gonna get my service mechanicals at this rate. I'd be grateful if you'd spare the time. We need his delivery soon as yesterday. Last he told me, he was taking a shortcut by Scylla, an asteroid in the Charybdis cluster. That's where I'd start, were I the adventuring type. You look out, though. The place is probably crawling with outlaws. All right, let's go see the man. I'm just gonna hang in the back and try not to touch anything. Ah, yes. Wheeler messaged me you were coming. He must be the captain of the Unreliable, a vessel that used to be helmed by one Alex Hawthorne. And you are not he. Has something happened to my favorite scruffy freelancer? There's no need for hysterics. This is all a hilarious misunderstanding. I impounded Alex's ship, not yours. Well, I guess it's yours now if you're captaining it. It's a, a game we play, he and I. I ask him to turn in Phineas Wells. He tells me he will soon. I impound his ship. He explains why he can't give me the info right now. I ask him to turn in Wells. Around and around we go. something very off about Phineas Wells. I'm not going to turn him in just yet. Right, right. You're going important places, I'm sure. Big, exciting, important places. <laughs> there, I've removed the flag from your ship. I'm terribly sorry for the inconvenience. Uh, however, before you go, Alex promised to tell me the location of Phineas Wells. I'm sure you've seen his wanted posters all over the colony. Did Alex tell you where Wells might be? anything at all 
You haven't read the posters? He's a terrorist, a thief, a madman. It's really in the colony's best interest that we stop him before he does further harm. Well, Alex knew, or he said he did. And you have his ship. Maybe he kept some records around, or a conveniently placed note on his bedside table. That's... Uh, well, that's just terrible news. Paul, what am I going to do now? The board will have my head. Oh, I'm sorry. This is terribly unprofessional of me. Is there anything else I might help you with? Miss Doyle owes the board a significant sum. Alas, the only collateral she has is her organs. Compulsory donation is quite legal in such cases. Compulsory donation. That's not unreasonable. I guess it's better than losing your organs, but... I don't know, Captain. It just doesn't seem right. Miss Doyle is deeply in debt, and the board has every right to do whatever they like to recoup that debt. What guarantee do I have that she'll agree to the terms you negotiate? I quite concur. It's refreshing to deal with someone practical for a change. I will recall my collection agent. Tell Miss Doyle to report to me promptly for her first assignment. Now, is there anything else you need, or... Can I return to my work? Hmm. That option kept coming up over and over and over again. That can't be coincidental. Does it remind you of anything? I mean, other than... Firefly and Fallout. No. I could say it was good to see you, Ellie. Uh, where is she? She's already gone. The hell. Looks like you paid my debt to Jesse. I guess that means I owe you now, right? Tell you what, I'm a little short on bits at the moment, but I'm a decent scrapper and a better than average sawbones. If you're looking for a medic, I can work my debt off. If I'm being honest, and I prefer not to, I was about ready to pick up another contract anyway. And you settled this in a pretty tidy fashion, which tells me you're competent. But we can say I'm repaying the favor if you prefer that version. A medic, hey? You won't be sorry. Or if you are, just add it to my debt and we'll figure something out. Welcome to the crew, Miss Ellie. We're real happy to have you. Dialogue, stealth, and tech, all soft-capped. Well, close. Pretty damn good. Auto mag pistol, hey? 220 DPS, you don't say. Well, let's just put these down here. Well, sorry. Maybe I didn't explain myself clearly enough. Um... I'm going to give you a grenade launcher. Yeah. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> and uh, what else? This little plasma cutter. I like this. Ten medical. 
Medical skill. Threat generated base health. Heal amount granted by the medical inhaler. Yeah, see? Now that... That is something. Takes light. Damage type plasma, but it takes light ammunition. That's perfect. Yeah, that's actually super perfect. Um, what else do I want to use? Just that and that, I guess. Give me the little stabby stab. Try that for an energy weapon. It's pretty low DPS though. Everything's low DPS. All right, I currently have two companions right now. That's pretty dope. Um, Now I can get back on my ship at least, then we can finish up a few things. Do we go into waste disposal? Gotta be something in here. Oh my god. I can't go anywhere except on here. Oh, fantastic. Oh, we could get up the top of there somehow, maybe. Interesting. Same room. Very weird. The toilets overflowed on the elite one. Uh, it smells awful. And not all of it's mine. Oh, thank you, stranger. Shit, ain't that a relief. Dude, you were stuck in here? That's revolting. I have no idea how good the air on Groundbreaker smells until you've been trapped in a tiny bathroom with an overflowing toilet. Thanks again, friend. Time stood still. I was aware of nothing but the smell. Ugh, could have been days. Ah, shit. That means I haven't clocked out in days. Song is gonna have my ass for wage theft. <laughs> You're gonna shake me down <laughs> after I was trapped in a shit covered bathroom? Yes. Is that how it is? Hey, let's not be hasty. Here, I've got a few bits on me. Take it. Just take it, and we'll forget this ever happened, yeah? Suppose it's time to reevaluate my career goals. Hmm. 
That's that, huh? Everything's here sells for a price, so you know I'm gonna take it. Apologies to whoever owned it, but um Ooh, the key card for yeah yeah yeah. Another rifle there. Maybe a stronger rifle than what I had before. Tactical shotgun. Light ammunition. 238 DPS. Hmm. What did I just pick up? Rest and go. Locked rooms and saves. Safes in the rest and go. Chef. Chef. Garçon means boy. Ma'am, not feeling too well, huh? the rest and go. I'm walking here. Rest and, rest and go key card? No, no, no. See, I already... Oh, wait, I can only open one? Oh, that sucks. I didn't realize that. I think I can get another one? Yep. I need one more. Who else would have one? Uh, I'm selling today. Optional rest and go key card. Saltuna shortage? No, say it ain't so. I 
feel like I'm being judged right now by my companions. This isn't like Skyrim. What's that? Pay to view movies, pay to view serials, hack, access guest messages. A fool and his bits are soon not together anymore. So the only room I can't really clear out is the one with uh, the lady in it. I was just sitting down for tea. Okay, we're not gonna we're not gonna pay for it, so we wanna go. Ah, <sighs> we're gonna go to the the planet. Purpleberry bunch. I just got that. Okay, we're good. That was worth. Back to the ship, hey? Hey, you got a second? Fancy running into you. I had a feeling we'd be running into each other again. Admiring your ship from up close. Got to hand it to you, boss. That's a fine-looking ship. Only thing it's missing is me. What? No. No, no, no. Okay. Yeah, maybe a little. I'm not trying to be all creepy like I just want to make a good case for myself. Just give me a shot. That's all I'm asking. I could be the best damn crew you ever hired. Wow. <laughs> you don't know how long I've been waiting to hear that. Thanks, boss. You're not going to regret this. I'll just gather my personals and meet you on board. This is going to be great. You got a crew now, Felix. These personals? Do you want to grab the personals before you go on? We are back on. So first things first, I got to talk to Ada. Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? The unit is a cleaning sam. Hawthorne brought it on board some cycles ago. I'm sure with the intent to modify it, but I've never seen it up and running. Alex likely recorded progress notes detailing his efforts to modify Sam. If you check the terminal in your captain's quarters, we may be able to determine what work remains in order for Sam to properly operate. 
Yes, Captain. Beginning playback now. There's... there's viscera and death everywhere. Gunfire, gnashing teeth, the unemployed. For law's sake, if anyone's receiving this, please send help. What? Uh, no, 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 no. Captain, we are now capable of accessing the Roseway landing pad. Also, corporate protocol requires that all distress signals include a list of key personnel for retrieval. The embedded names are Anton Crane, Von Cortez, and Orson Shaw. Certainly, Captain. What would you like to hear? It's been scientifically proven that those with more birthdays live longer. As you wish, Captain. I must comply with all direct orders. I have lots of minutes, many minutes, unlimited minutes, perhaps. Providing an adequate power source, I can function indefinitely. I require a captain to pilot the ship. Without an identified captain or crew, I serve no purpose. As you may be aware, Captain Alex Hawthorne was a smuggler of some repute. I failed to predict the likely outcome of his reckless behavioral patterns. I should have predicted that. In our travels together, Alex liked to pass time by, as he called it, tinkering to improve my design. How can I be of assistance? Take care. I require a functioning captain to run the ship. Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? What part of the colony would you like to discuss? Where in Monarch? Ah, Monarch. So let's go to, let's do the quest for the, the lady here. That is, if you don't count sublife smugglers quartered Fallbrook. May luck be with you. Of course, as I am sure you are aware, luck does not exist. But it seems to comfort humans to believe they possess good quantities of it. Felix, you are a... Heavy. That's fine, whatever. Um, what skills do you have? The kills, the skills seem quite... Basic for the companions. So I think I'll, I'll eventually not roll with one. I did get the pink helmet. That's cool. And the chef's hat. Lockpick max distance. That's pretty dope. Let's keep that. Let's add some mods to some armor. Wait, why can I only modify that? Hmm. Heavy weapons and stealth minus five. Yeah, no, we're not going to wear that.
Uh, right then, quests. Weapons from the Void. Hawthorne's Terminal. That's what I have to do. Few key modifications. Suds steeper. Acid steeper. Why other science weapon on Scylla? Right then. I remember putting a tree there. To Scylla we go. Wait, 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 wait. One moment. Ask Pravati about Jun Lee, which we haven't done yet. Uh, where is she hanging out? Right here. Hey, Captain. Can I get your temperature on something real quick? So, Jun Lee and I have been talking some. Through messages? I got him here on my data pad, and well, she sent me a poem. One she wrote her own self, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if I should read into it. Because poems are all symbolic and such, right? It's not so good. But real sweet. Oh, law. That's what's got me spooked. I don't rightly know. It's about this engine that's been shaking itself apart. Then this lady mechanic comes by and lays one hand on it. And the trouble goes away. It sings. I don't want to get too hopeful, but... I'm wondering if maybe she's the engine and I'm the lady? It's a real romantic poem. It made my chest hurt, kinda. I don't know where it's leading yet, or if I'm misinterpreting. I'm not much interested in physical stuff. Never have been. Leastways, not like other folks seem to be. It's not that I can't, I just don't care for it. It's been a problem in the past. The folk who wanted to be with me back in the Vale, they didn't... They said I was cold. Thanks, Captain. That makes me feel a touch better. I actually had another message from Junlei. I just couldn't work up the courage to open it. But I'm gonna change that. Right now. Okay, here we go. Let's see here. Talking about old friends, got to thinking... Of Isabel. Who's... Who's Isabel? They were... Close, Captain. Like, more than friends close. Why is this option locked to me? wasn't nothing body, if that's what you're thinking. It was just honest and full of typos. 
Captain, I'm feeling all mixed up right now. Could we maybe head to the Groundbreaker? Get some drinks at that bar there? Lost Hope? It's a manic panic. What's up, dude? Great to see you, man. Welcome in. How's your night? Good to hear. Well, we have fireworks going. I'm playing this new game that I haven't ever played before. And uh, yeah, it's dope, man. Paper Mario? Dude, I really liked Paper Mario. I can't remember what I played it on. Maybe like GBA? Does that sound right? It's like a very basic RPG, but uh, yeah. They're doing alright? Well, I think, uh, I think Loaf is asleep, so... Other than that, Zoe's chilling out in the bed. She doing just fine. Thanks, Captain. I'll be ready. Big Vivardi, the last hope on the groundbreaker. Well, we're still here. Might as well do it now. Get it over and done with. I mean, tend to my people's needs. Oh, I can take multiple people? Oh, no shit. Alright. Well, let's just take Bravati. Yeah, I don't remember a lot about Paper Mario other than I always had difficulty with the timing of some uh, hammer bonks on the head. But other than that, it was fun. I don't normally dig Nintendo games, so I, I was pretty invested in that. Why is it telling me to go see Gladys again? Oh, because we need to buy the thing from Gladys. Ironic that the bar is called The Last Hope. This work? Do we get a table? Stand in a corner? A new face. What's your pleasure, stranger? Only the usual. Marauders all over space. Have you played this before? You ever Manic. Folk who can't figure the it's very much like, uh... A spoon can manage to get ships into very much like Fallout. What ain't I got? What ain't I got? What about weapons and armor? Just to start. Yeah, that's actually identical to what somebody said earlier. Well, you're here. Okay, so what are we drinking? You're the expert. Oh, and don't worry on the price. I got this. Let's just do it proper. Well, that's fruit and such, right? Okay, wine it is. No Bottom sweat, dude. Straight oh, from the good. bottle. Really kind of nice, actually. Who'd have guessed old fruit could taste so good? Oh, Captain. I'm pining for June like something fierce. What am I doing? I mean, just with June like... This is an interesting side quest. Us. Well, she talked about another girl, right? Isabel. Mentioned her by name and everything, like she wanted me to know. Maybe I've been making a right fool of myself this whole time. Maybe she's not interested after all. It was real long and rambly. She was telling me a story about her dad. And a lady named Isabel did all sorts of things to try to win his favor. This Isabel lady never quite managed to get her dad's approval, but they carried on anyways. Made something good out of a bad situation. Then it all went down the tubes. Do you think June Lay still has feelings for her? Well, 
maybe... Maybe she just wanted to let me know her preferences. In a less awkward way. But that made it more awkward. I, I need another drink. Right now. Before I lose my nerve. Uh, something stronger, I'm thinking. I'm still all tense and weird inside. All right, whiskey. Woo, that smells like an unlawful union between paint thinner and propellant. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, mm. oh I'm going to be sick. That, that's a crime is what that is. Oh, Captain, I want to talk to Junlei all the time. Even about silly things, but oh, I'm so scared. Um, everything? I got a solar system's worth of terrifying questions swirling around my head. Does she think I'm as pretty as I think she's handsome? What if she doesn't like me? What if she does? What if she's still got feelings for that lady, Isabel? What if we, we get together and she gets bored of me? Don't you tease me in my moment of weakness. You know I'm not interested in physical affection. That's... Well, it's tripped folks up in the past. Folks I thought cared about me for me. What if she's not okay with that? What if she is, but then later, she's not? Just move on? Like snapping your fingers? I don't know. Maybe I got a weak heart. It all just seems impossible. Yeah. Yeah, I know you're right. Just wish it were that easy, is all. I'm not used to speaking free with folks. Back in Edgewater, there wasn't no one who wanted to know my mind. Excepting my dad. Gosh, I don't know that I got that in me. Sometimes I feel real mean inside, Captain. I think ungenerous thoughts. Yeah. I like the way you put that. Like, it's okay to want to be better for her, but not impossible to try. Well, Captain, this has been... This has been a whole lot. I got just... Wow. So much to think about. Oh, gosh. I... I don't know, Captain. Do you think I should? All right, all right. There's no need to strip your screws over it. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Right when we get back to the ship. Ship. I mean, probably. Eventually. Thanks for hearing me out and giving me counsel. And, well, for being a friend. It means a whole lot. You're good people, Captain. Come on, let's go. I'm really not. But I do care about my ship people. Do I want to talk to this lady still? Mm -mm. Have you had a moment to look into that little opportunity I told you about on Roseway? Roseway. You hurry up. Someone will get to snooping around there before you do. Anytime, sweetheart. Where the hell am I? I'm the worst in video games, I swear. I just get lost, like, all the time.
Back to the ship we go, no sweat. Easy peasy. Didn't I request no more fertilizer shipments be brought on board? Who keeps ordering these? What the hell? Hey, Captain. I hope I wasn't too much bother at the bar. I did have fun, and I tried some things I never would have otherwise. Oh, that whiskey to give my headache and something fierce. Feels like a primal's chewing on my skull. I messaged June Lei when we got back, and she replied super quick. <clears throat> okay. I was awake half the night, thinking about what I sent, anxious to see what you said. I reread my message in the morning, and it was unclear. I was drinking when I sent it, otherwise I wouldn't have had the courage. Also, sorry for the typos. I've ruined things in the past, because I didn't say things I should have, like, I've met someone who's become special to me. I want to be honest with her, so if she feels the same about me, there won't be any surprises. Oh, isn't she sweet? It's like one of those two-bit romances where one soul's all stiff and formal, and I should be glad to perhaps take hold of your hand, miss. I ought to go write her back. I mean, I already did. Twice. <laughs> but anyhow, thanks for taking me out, Captain. Good for her. All right. Rose will. Wait, where the hell is Rose will? Rose way. And the cleaning machine. Back on Terra? Ah, there we go. That makes sense. Another landing site. We're now in orbit above Roseway, Captain. We gotta talk. This Roseway business smells. Something tells me things didn't end well for the guy who made the distress call. And whoever or whatever got him will be waiting for us. I like the whole two companion system. No security. Not that I'm complaining.
I think with those purchases, my intentions are clear. Okay, let's go. Something chewed clear through that armor. Let's hope we don't run into whatever it was. That would be really bad. I got so many hacking parts and and lockpicks. But I don't seem to even be needing them. That machine... Well, now I need them. That's cool. Reconditioned exo helmet. Hmm, okay. Did anyone ever play Fallout 76? I heard that had a very rough launch, but it's somewhat decent-ish now. Don't know if I'm willing to do that. Terminated. Auntie Cleo values your commitment to serving our company. Yeah, we missed whatever happened here. Borst Verst. I done had enough of this shit. I'm just the fucking tarmac guard. No one said nothing about fighting no raps. Alarms went off, raps broke loose, and I hightailed it in here to get a wall between me and them beasts. Scientist, name of Anton Crane. Someone said he's panicking inside the comm center. Um... Forget I said anything about that. Distress call from here? Shit. They told me that weren't allowed. Got me. I just do what I'm told, and I was told not to do such. Oh, before I forget, Auntie Cleo's makes the best pharmaceuticals in Halcyon. Better than nature. Not like that crap spacer's choice pedals.
Ah, outlaws, I assume. Do me a favor and let me finish this, will you? And then make it quick, please. Aren't you with the brutes that attacked our lab? Aren't you here to pillage our supplies and leave our corpses to the raptodons? Oh, well, good luck. Now, take out your clubs and make this. What's the matter? Ah, horses, you idiot. Just put it... Ah, of course, because I didn't... Oh, uh, you're still here. If you haven't already, you might speak to Anton. He can point you in the right direction. Now, take out your clubs and make this. What's the matter? Ah, horses, you idiot. Just put it... Ah, of course, because... What does it look like? I'm preparing a personal defense device. Or trying to, anyway. I... Why, yes. I suppose I could. Thanks. No. Uh, well, yes. Well, uh, no. Uh, perhaps. I left schematics in our storage facility. As far as I know, the security commander hasn't found them yet. I admit I'd feel better were they returned to me. Say, uh, you wouldn't happen to have a tube of thermal paste on you, would you? Blast! Well, good luck. I hope I see you back here in one piece. This place has secrets, man. Why'd they lock it up? Exactly. So there's more people here than I expected. And they seem to be acting quite normal, which is weird. Um, search for secrets. Company secrets that could be sold to the highest bidder through Gladys. Acquire the weapon plans. Orson's prototype would likely be valuable. Now, out of curiosity, I wonder if we could give it back to Orson. And then reacquire it somehow. Some, some mechanism may allow us to do that. Just a thought. Don't go getting any ideas. If you've come to end my life, let's be on with it. Wow, everyone's so bleak. You're not actually one of them, are you? Yes, yes. Anton Crane, lead scientist here. I must apologize if my call diverted you. I uh, may have panicked. Everything's under control now, though, truth be told. Standard operating procedure for suits, boss. They're all a bunch of cowards. An attack. One that I'd wager was due to the nature of my research here. I'm not at liberty to discuss the nature of the work I'm doing here. Suffice it to say that its importance to me, uh, to the colony, is immeasurable. Nah, you're gonna have to tell me that, I'm afraid. More often than not, seems I'm the only one who sees the opportunity here. A ticket to the good life once my research plays out. Byzantium. Recognition, money, proper facilities. No more uninspired dolts like my associates here. And might you be the sort of person who's, uh, not averse to risking your life? If the pay were right? 
hours ago, a group of vicious malcontents fell upon us, shot up our labs and loosed our research subjects the raptodons. If those Cretans get their hands on my research, well, Fel need not kill me. You have a point there. It most decidedly cannot make this situation any worse. All right. We were tasked with formulating a new and improved dental gel. One cannot exaggerate the benefits of good dental hygiene. May I continue? While doing research on enzymes specific to the Raptodon's digestive system, we developed an additive which we subsequently discovered to be the most effective appetite suppressant ever. Not just any diet toothpaste, the ultimate diet toothpaste. Oh, I'm certain it could be made into that as well, with only a few changes to its molecular composition. But you're missing the point. Let's focus for a moment, shall we? Even if you disregard the obvious value of Auntie Cleo's Apazap diet toothpaste in and of itself, we're talking about my career here as well. Nice, is it not? Came up with that myself. It's a shame our marketing department is almost as befuddled as my co-workers here. Yes, but don't kill the mother if it's avoidable. We've need of her to replenish our stocks. I think there's gas in the lab somewhere that can be used to put them out. The research is in the safe in my office. You'll have need of my code and key card. The lab's entrance is in the side of a hill. You can't miss it if you just follow the road. You'll pass by the town's original... by the Grand Architect. Jameson. He's in the old lab. My protege. I sent him to retrieve some metabolic precursors, and I forgot him. That would surely lighten the weight on my conscience, as I am held to account for the well-being Interesting. of every scientist here. Too many have been lost. Too many black marks against my name, as it were. And far too much paperwork. Level 12. Hey. Next level. Fifteen percent health restored per kill. Ooh, consumable weight. Carrying capacity. Oh, it's bonus from companions. Dialogue skills. Oh, we get ten by default, huh? That puts all three at 60. When you have no companions. Ah. Uh, vendor buying price. Yeah, that might be a good place to start, actually. Okay. Okay. Uh. Wait. What quest is currently being tracked right now? Acquire the weapon plans. Yes. This crane guy cares more about his research than his own people. Picked a hell of a day to visit. I'm Vaughn. Vaughn Cortez. Uh, Dr. Vaughn Cortez. But just Vaughn's fine, really. Over in the main labs. I rabbited back here when I realized I was hearing gunshots, not blown fuses. 
We've been cooped up in here, I don't know, hours? Too long. I have to get back to work. Uh, Dr. Crane might say otherwise. Me? When those guys started shooting the place up, I was first out the door. I had to leave an experiment running at the lab. Something I've been working on a long while. Something that could really get me ahead. Know what I mean? I've been extracting organic compounds from raptodons. Compounds that have... The music's actually very similar to Mass Effect benefits. as well. Whoa, slow down. Benefits? In certain social situations. Personal situations. Where you might want to, um, enhance your charisma. Oh, for... He's making enraptured, Captain. An aphrodisiac. Wrapped musk is the main ingredient. What? No. I mean, yes, I'm getting the musk. With Monarch Embargo, the price is sky high. But I'm not making the drug. Sure. Of course. Our lab's south of here, down the road. Not the old public lab, the one past that, built into the mountainside. My equipment's in the lower levels, way in the back. I have a big room all to myself. Dissection tables and whatnot. It should have been running this whole time. Just grab the results and bring them here. No, I mean... Eh. In fact, don't mention this to Dr. Crane. At all. If you have a buyer. I got a contact who wants to haul the entire batch to Byzantium. Help me out, I'll cut you in for a share. I'll even pay you before I am. When you deliver to me. Great! <sighs> this is really gonna save my ass. Charisma enhancing benefits he was talking about. He was just blowing smoke, right? So much to do. help yourself to anyone's stuff. I mean, an honorable person definitely wouldn't do that. Alright, well. Time to go... Stick, check out the research facility, I suppose. Glad it's not my ammunition being wasted by that guy. 1800 XP per kill, what? Think we'll find any freakish experiments locked away in there? Of course we will. System searching for <laughs> Why so serious? 
Hey, what? I didn't tell you guys to go in. Everyone else, leave me alone. I'm going in. I know this is the wrong, the wrong facility, but it's got to be some good stuff in here, no? Augmented anodization, electrocharged surface, nightingale step, volume from footsteps, radius of footsteps sounds. Pretty good, I guess. Just more stuff to sell, if you ask me. Clear Lab Office Keycard. Nice. Good start. It seems odd to me that you don't necessarily need heavy specialization to gain, like, lockpick and hacking uh, you, do you know what i mean like yes you're less offensively inclined but storage facility passcode More advanced defensive helmet side. That kind of makes backtracking worth it, right? And then investing those points um, uh, kind of a valuable thing. Like at the moment, I, f I don't feel like anything's stopping me from getting anywhere, pretty much. I mean, other than, you know, combat. on the wrong side of that crate. Well, nothing really in here. Some basic stuff. Right, I'm starting to feel that 
Um, which is which is an odd feeling because it's considering I'm only like 15 hours in, if that. Like I I'm not heavily well. I mean, I've soft capped most of my like these these three sections. That's another thing as well. You've got like all these here related to dialogue, which opens up so many options. Then you've got all of these here and all of these here, which whilst they are related, I'm only now at the point of specialization if I want to take something all the way. So we'll see. We'll see what's even worth doing. Unable to record symptoms, this patient died within the hour. Don't kill the mother, remember? Although I think that's in the other uh, laboratory. Another finger. One ten minute break between your normally scheduled three o'clock and four o'clock patrol shifts. That corporate life, though. Did he seriously just say don't mess with the best? Fiasco? I'll have you know, thank you very much, that I had to, I, I, I pained over that decision for at least three minutes. No, not, the, I don't care about the beasts. I care about the front door. This is an egregious breach of protocol. How'd you get in? Ugh, can't use the centrifuge without supervision. Can't file reports without him double-checking their every word. Can't save myself from mortal peril. It's like he thinks I'm a child. His hands-on management style is coming to a point of contention, I tell you. Please. That man doesn't have an altruistic bone in his body. I just happen to have the metabolic precursors from our last test. I'd wager my last bit that if you brought back the precursors and left me for dead, Anton wouldn't bat an eye. What? No. <laughs> Come on. There's no call for that. If the way's clear, I'll head on back.
Uh, Monkey Lawn Gnome, thank you very much for your gifted sub, my dude. Next on the lift. Lift? Next on the list for snake feeding is flannel violin and the name is Pawn, P-A-W-N. Should I open the back up as well? We got two waiting. So Magic Pickle with Fast Food and Outdoor Special with uh, Remy. Okay, we can do that. Got it. Okay. Yeah, open them back up. Just, I would say leave it open. Whatever reason you need to like cut it down or something. Okay. Let me know when you're ready. Yo, another gifted sub? Monkey Lawn Gnome, you are now top of the leaderboard for the month. <laughs> Thank you, dude. Um, and. Two is a prime number, so, um, wait, is two prime? Round prime, right, no, you're right, yeah, yeah, Steve, yeah, okay. Um, the 50,000 channel point redemption, uh, name a rat has been reopened. For anyone curious, you can name a rat. We film it as we give the rat to a snake. Whether the snake takes it or not, I cannot promise that. Um, but uh, we record a video. I upload it to my secondary YouTube channel. Send you a private link. And uh, yeah, that's that. We currently have uh, three in the queue. Uh, soon to be two. All right, let's go downstairs here. There we go, back down. Where are these files? I need the files. Oh, you want me to go back outside? Because the files are in the other laboratory. Schematics over there. Data over there. Good XP too. Keep up the good work. Looks like I'm going to need another vending machine. Just non stop vending machines. That's all I need. Unless you give them soup up light machine guns, then they do work. Oh, interesting. Um, yeah, I'm thinking about running solo, actually. And, like, I don't know if I can get rid of people from the ship. Um, but if that's possible, there's a pretty significant advantage. Uh, plus 10 to all stats if you do that. If you get the right perk. Am I wrong for looking at this colossal machine of destruction and thinking, Felix, you should hijack that? No, Felix, you should hijack that. 
Nice to get a little fresh air on your lungs. All right, here we go. Well. To whom it may concern, I've been an Auntie Cleo man my whole knife, L knife life. When I got promoted to the Roseway deforestation team, I felt privileged and honored. I believe Auntie Cleo was going to tame the wild landscape and pave it over with civilization better than nature. That's your motto. You have found my letter of resignation. I would rather make my own way as an outcast living outside the law then work under these conditions. See, I've, I've, I'm amassing lockpicks now um, because I have uh, either a perk or shit or something that just lets me use use them for free, unlock stuff for free, which is really weird. Alright, let's go. Oh, I am over encumbered. So. One sixty eight for a pulse hammer, eh? Dead eye assault rifle. I don't even know if these are worth keeping. I probably should have just left some of this shit on my ship. Pristine. Telescoping staff mark two. It's actually pretty decent. I I literally don't need any of this stuff. Two sixteen, I've got a better one, I think, yeah. Very uh, No Man's Sky vibes here. Pisses me off because I don't want to like that game. storage facility I think I think one thing it's missing is the grit of Fallout Despite everything looking dirty, it feels clean. Does that make sense? I think Fallout. Four excluded, but three and and New Vegas had um, a very sharp look to the game, and I think that really helped. It, it's a little bit janky now, like it hasn't aged well, um, 
but it definitely helped the vibe of the game. Yeah, that's my, that's my standard ammo right there. If you need to get into the armory and don't have the code, ask me if I'm not around. Check the front desk. Acid steeper, nice. That's for quests. Plasma carbine. Carbine, I would say. I've heard both pronunciations. Another dead eye rifle. Nobody in this damn town knows how to clean up after themselves. Schematics. Retrieve awesome schematics. Done that. Return to Orson. Alright. Give them back to Orson. Steal them from Orson. Report Orson for theft. Kill Orson. Take schematics to the lady on the breaker ship. Um, yeah. That's a, that's a really good point, uh, Ex Mortis. Yeah, I would agree with that. There's definitely a lineage with, uh, with Fallout. And I... If we can talk about Fallout 3 and, and 4 for a moment... The collection of bobbleheads. For some reason, that was one of the main things that drew me into that game. Um, like it's it's a very significant find when you find a a, a bobblehead, right? Um, and it makes a massive difference to the game. This doesn't have that, and I know it's just a basic thing, but the problem is the rest of the upgrade system here is also basic already. Um, I don't know. That's less of a complaint. That's a that's a me thing, not a game thing. It was the house <laughs> the bubble headstand? Oh, don't forget your your very first settlement which is literally a roof and 
four beds. <laughs> if you can call them beds. Sleeping bags. Marauder ringleader, hey? They didn't get the drop on shit. Well, they, they got the drop on me there. I'll try to hurry this time. Wow. Guys, you gotta relax. I don't know how these guys are even here since we... Well, maybe we came out the wrong door. I don't know. I'll try again. Oh, fuck off. You're the last thing I need to deal with right now. He's knocked. Going left. Clear. Reviving. Something on your mind? No. Yeah, we, we, we entered the wrong door there. Or was it the right door? Play combat FPS games? Dude, I'd be shit. You do, I'm a liability. You do not want me on your team. <laughs> I will get you fucking wrecked every day. <laughs> the true question is, do I want to become a Call of Duty streamer or a Tarkov streamer? I look, I would love to be great at those games. I really would. I, um, but there's no way I'm ever going to spend any time in FPS trainer or whatever it's called. My mouse is still... I took all the weights out. It's still too damn heavy. I need a light... a lightweight mouse. Speaking of... Um, actually, let's... let's do that before I forget. We're gonna... I'm gonna change up the stream a little bit. Why am I so orange? I'm not that orange. What'd I do to my camera? Um... If you have a keyboard recommendation, well, I'll get to it later, but if you have a keyboard and mouse recommendation, I need new ones. Um, I have a few of these spare, but they are really heavy. Um, so I'm looking for a new one. G502, mm-hmm. Hello, Dragon. How you doing? 
I saw this actually. I did see a cool mouse with um, like the whole. It was skeletonized almost. Had like little holes all the way through it. It was pretty cool. Uh, that was a wireless one. I don't think I need a wireless mouse. Maybe that'll give me the edge. I don't know. And keep you. Let's sort by value, please. Had to put some weights in. I had weights in the mouse and I had to take them out after playing, of all games, uh, Power Washing Simulator. Let's put extra armor on. Sneak plus seven. Are there weights when playing marbles? Uh, fortunately, marbles is um, very friendly on the wrists. Let's lockpick. But this has like four mod slots? Question mark? It's a Marauder helmet. Let's get rid of it. I don't need no Marauder shit. Persuade. See, I don't need any of that. My dialogue options are already so good. Mm, long guns, nine armor though. No bueno. Right, where are we going now? Hundred and sixty two meters that way, two hundred and forty nine back that way. Experiment Anton's data. Back to Gladys. Hmm. I, um, the G502, I picked up uh, about four or five of them when they were on a ridiculous special. I mean, like 20 bucks each at Best Buy. Um, so I picked up a whole stack of them in one go. So for the price of one mouse, I've got now still two or three in the in my cupboard. Um, and every time they start to go bad, I just get rid of them. But yeah, they're too heavy. My my tastes have changed. Got so many mods too. Let's start getting rid of that garbage. X extra fi? What the hell's an extra fi? I don't mind spending a little bit on good equipment. 
The keyboard I'm thinking of getting is uh, Razer with the little LCD screen at the top. Um, I'm currently using a Corsair, but yeah. I could take it or leave it. Oh, hi. Did I expect to find you here? I like your armor, Porter. Who the... You. Yeah, you. Get over here. Really? Get that out of my face. Or... You care to explain what you're doing here? Did you miss the big sign outside? Looks like a giant grime trap. A little, yeah. Name's Porter. Doc Crane did send you. I'd be glad for the help. Bad news is we haven't been able to clean these outlaws out Name's of the Preston. Land. Preston Garvey. Good news is they haven't been able to escape neither. For now, I reckon they got no backup. On the other hand, we don't neither. And our mechanicals all went haywire for some damn reason. Damn mechanicals have always been more trouble than they're worth. The garage and the front door are it. These bastards got in through the vent system, but we locked that down. They're not getting back out that way without a security key card. They need to take mine. Or make a new one in my office, I guess. Why you want to know that? What for? Fair point. Here's a key card to my office. Head left from here and downstairs. It's across from the cafeteria. I got a machine that makes pass cards for us. Just don't knock over any paperwork in there. I got a system. Carry on. Have a good night, monkey. Take care, man. See you soon. Picking up all these books, I don't know what they're for. It ain't stealing if no one sees. It ain't stealing if the text ain't read either. I won't tell. Why'd they lock it up? You got any more fingers, Captain? Nimblest fingers in all the land.
I get in there? There's ro ro robots in there. Oh, how about the door? System. Right, here we go. Good job. Oh, it's a big boy. Felix, you're getting injured, dude. Not cool. Time for a drink? Robophobia. Dexterity, perception, and temperament minus one. Auto mechanicals now give you the willies. No. Like, <laughs> come on, man. I mean, a perk point may have more positives than out that like would outweigh that. I don't know. All this good stuff, though. It's all cashola to me. I have 2,490 light ammo. Ah, uh, whoops. Shit. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I ain't spending that much money. I meant to sell. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, that means I have to go through that fight again, huh? It's fine. No, I don't think so. Let's collect a few things, maybe. Oh yeah, big fight in here. Incoming. Reduced to ashes. Take your best shot, I think we're good, right? Now let's sell this time and not waste a shitload of money. Sell.
Sedative gas canister. Okay. Raptigon. Oh, that's right. I'm not meant to kill the raptor mom. Yeah, even the, even the collection part of this is getting a little bit tedious since it's just for, it's just for cash. I think we did it. All right. What's next, please? I've got 8k in the bank. Where the hell did that come from? Down there, yep. Hey, you. Over here. Cassandra O'Malley, hello. Oh good. You're not shooting at me. Not this far. It's been a bit of a day, so I'll get to the point. Yes, I have Crane's research. No, I'm not giving it back. Sorry to disappoint you. Interesting. Yes, I imagine he does. But we all have problems. It is the human condition. I am myself ensnared in this wretched place. You want to kill me. I don't want to die. Therefore, it is in my best interest to negotiate with you. Help me get out of here, and I will pay you for my life. The first thing I need is a key card to unlock my door. Then I'd need you to clear me a path out of here. There are two ways out. The quickest is through the front door, but Cleo security's bottled up in there. If you don't want to shoot them, I suppose you could talk to them. The other way out is through the loading bay, but you'd have to clear out the wraps for me. Then I could just slip out the back, sight unseen. Give me a little credit. We are not bandits. We do not steal research. We liberate it. So a few scientists were caught in the crossfire. I will not be accountable for every idiot who wanders in front of my gun. This lab is a prison, not a place of work. Those men were not scientists. They were indentured laborers. We liberated them. They should be thanking us. All wars have casualties. I regret taking a life, but we were doing them a mercy. Better to die than live in a state of slavery. We are all of us trapped. You, me, the scientists. This is not a colony. It is a slave camp. Yes, we raided the lab, shot some guards, killed a few scientists in the crossfire. But it was all for a higher cause. All wars have casualties. I regret taking a life, but we were doing them a mercy. Better to die than live in a state of slavery. I prefer freedom fighter, but I will not quibble over semantics. Come on now. Do you want to be dull and boring and servile like everyone else? Or do you want to break some rules? Because Crane is a tool. Because no good deed goes unrewarded. Because doing me a good turn is the honorable and decent thing. Take your pick. The research I carry is valuable. I am willing to go halves with you. And I will gladly negotiate with you, 
but only after you free me. I think you'll fail to understand how this works. Would you rather run errands for a corporate puppet like Crane? Listen, you are being used. Look around you. This colony is lousy with people like him. Shallow men with shallow lives, dreaming of nothing nobler than the next promotion. By helping him, you are helping the corporate hegemony exercise their stranglehold on the colony. Not hegemony. Gun to understand. I've always wondered how to pronounce that word. All wars have casualties. I regret taking a life, but we were doing them a mercy. Better to die than live in a state of slavery. I don't really have a choice, do I? You might be the first stroke of luck I've had all day. Thank you. I'm in your debt. Oh, that was my first failed quest by the looks of it. On my honor, you will be well rewarded. Nothing beyond the purview of a talented freelancer like you. You really expect me to just let them pass? Why? So they can regroup behind their walls and mount another assault? Never mind. I'm obviously in no position to argue with you. If you can talk those guards into standing down, my people will follow suit. Take your time. I am, to my chagrin, not going anywhere. I'm still gonna put them to sleep, don't I? How do I do such task? Incubation discovered. There's the matriarch. Okay, we don't want to take them out. Quest isn't botched yet, at least. Eliminate the outlaws. Create an escape route. Cover Anton's data. could still do this, right? Terminal and Chief Porter's office. office. 
near the ventilation system incapacitate the beasts near the ventilation system right before we kill them all preferably huh Hopefully this is the ventilation system. Many objectives, bro. I would ask what was on your mind, but the answer is obviously me. Oh, I'm gonna take you out. Fuck it, do it anyway. meters up there Looks like ventilation. That must be it. Look at that. <laughs> Those idiots got themselves a mama raptor gun. Ah, uh, shit. We don't have enough. WTF, bro. That's poop. I need another. Nope. I ain't here. There must be an optimal way to do these these quests here. You ain't fooling me.
She has got a shitload of health. I'm still coming in for that thing. I just got to find the key card generator. It's a bit of a mess, this one. Not my finest work. done a job of work after you cacked their employer the gun hand started surrendering or trying to slip out we heard it all from up here hell of a thing get down to roseway and talk to doc crane he'll make sure you get what's yours Lost some of my own in the fight, and a bunch of the staff died before we could get them to Roseway. Sign on my door says it is, but that ain't your trouble. Taking the fight to the bosses by gunning down a bunch of little folk. Real fucking bright, that one. I ain't saying things are perfect. But shooting towns up ain't the way to improve. All right, well. Still got to get that card, though, right? That's still an option. Bard. Hmm. XPL, hello again. How are you? Wait, is this another? No. Still need a card. Still need to get into his office. Still need a third canister. God knows where that is. We gotta get that as well. Grinding Tarkov. There's another one. Look at that. Vaughn's research, Anton's research. Is Tarkov free? Peel with the five month sub. Thank you, dude. Find a way through the service door to get Anton's research. Right, we can get it. Terminal Chief Porter's office that can print a security keycard. 
Three should be sufficient to subdue. Right. Genesis must be installed. Okay, so we can still do what I'm hoping to. It's not free. The second most expensive game. What? How? It's more than 60 bucks? Is it, um, like cosmetics and stuff to buy in, so in, in the game as well? DLCs? Season passes? Different versions? Of course there is! AUD to USD to rubles! <laughs> it's brutal! <laughs> Nice. The train game? The one the one that we used to sell at yeah. Uh old versions of Flight Simulator used to do the same thing. Um those little fucking expansion packs. You can lose everything, like, in the snap of a finger in Tarkov, right? See, that doesn't sound fun to me. That sounds actually quite infuriating. <laughs> Flamethrower, 480 DPS, what? Um, so in USD, which happens to be my current currency of choice, uh, what could I expect to pay for the Tarkov experience? Whatever the fuck that means. I'm going to regret asking this question. I would not let you. <laughs> That's not your game. Thank you. <laughs> I need one more canister, bro. Mind if I grab a few souvenirs? You don't recommend it to anyone. How is it so freaking popular then? That makes zero sense to me. It's all Pestily's fault. Game for people who like to get repeatedly punched in the balls. And it's a grindy game? It's 
Sitting in buildings waiting to snipe people. Run me through an average playthrough, right? Like, I've watched people play Apex and I've watched people play, um, the other one, Warzone. And it seems to be pretty, like, constant, right? But I've also watched, I have watched Pestily during his, uh, he did a, a marathon charity stream. And, uh, I mean, he's probably an exception. Most people wouldn't be of that level, but he had, like, night vision goggles and it, and he was like crawling through this jungle and it looked pretty dope. What some of my so I'm not big into FPS, right? That's pretty clear because I'm pretty shit at them. But some of my fondest memories from FPS are the very first Medal of Honor game. There was a map, a multiplayer map on that called God, I want to say Snowy Park. And it was quiet and very ambient. And you and your squad, or, or whatever, it was, might, might have been even like solo deathmatch, um, w would walk through the snow and, it, and the sound of the snow would be crunching under your feet, right? And, uh, and it was just, it was like you could see people off in the distance and you'd have to, you'd have to snipe them, you'd take them out or, or do whatever, right? Like it was, it was a cool game. Um, so I, I do have some memories. I mean, I when Jamez and I played CS, we're talking I'll keep it down. decades ago. Um, I wasn't very good at the game. He was. That was fun. When we won, we lost as well. Raiding for good gear, completing missions given to you. There's no battle royale component, it's just safer to kill everyone else. And then you go for the loot. And if you do if you do die and you, you get killed and stuff, whatever, what can get taken? Everything? Or just like some of your components? All right, I, I did it. I've put it all in. Now activate it. It's that one down there, isn't it? That matriarch looks fucking mean. Are they out? Are they sleeping? Yeah, they're sleeping. You good, Mama? You good. Okay. Hey, loot. How you doing? Is there like a, it's probably a no, but is there a demo for Tarkov? Hmm. 
Okay, so we've done that. Now all I need is the security card. Because I still need to pick up the loot from her body. Anton's office. Hey. There's the safe that was blown open. I do like me some good environmental storytelling. There we go. We have so many weapon mods, it's unreal. I'm going to have to dump, dump them because they all, they weigh. Holy shit. All right, now back to the corpse of Cassandra. She did mess with the wrong person here. Sorry, folks, one sec. Just posted a sped up version of Faye's mouse dance in the animal channel. It's hilarious and I'm sure chat will love it. That comes from Ms. Queeb. Um, if you care to look at uh, the way we entice a snake with food, click the first link listed there, the Discord link, if you want to watch that video. Twenty one meters. There we go. All right, so I think that worked out pretty well. Return to Gladys on Groundbreaker, acquire Vaughn's research. Right, so we still got to do that too. Babysitting drunk friends and getting them home safely. That's a very nice friend you are. done here. Oh, we ain't done yet. More stuff to sell. Love it. I got 9,313 bucks. And a shitload more stuff. Oh my god. Value to weight ratio. Fascinating. Melee ranged. Just go with by value, eh? Hmm. 
The Vermin. 205 DPS handgun. Damage 123. Mm. Heavy rounds though. How's my heavy rounds doing? Weight five. Oh, okay, okay. Elite troop armor twenty six. You're the ultimate warrior. Uh, worry about that later. Let's get out of here now. What the hell? What the hell? Jeez, Louise. You good? Oh, you're dead. All right. Who's next? Um, Anton. Gross. I still need... Someone's research. We did get the research. That one, Vaughn's research or experiment, whatever. Just where? 57 meters? Could have sworn I've been through here before. Bard. No, 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 no. Hmm. Oh, it's in the same room where the Raptodons were. I think. Nope, straight up, just a room that I missed. Good work, Queeb. Good work. Medical school. Yeah, I think the loot in this game is less exciting than Fallout as well. It's like, oh, you found like a dozen other weapons that you can kind of compare the stats on, but they're all the same. In Fallout, if you collect something new, it, it feels like new. Vertex Mace. Now that sounds new. Okay. 
Now we must be done done. So you want me to grow back to the groundbreaker? Not quite ready for that. Have I played Stalker games? Mm hmm I think I've played a couple of them, yeah. The only one that I remember, though... You've returned. What news? Uh, you've recovered my research. Without my work... You were going down a tunnel, the lights kept flickering, you had to, like, wind up some kind of generator or something, and it was pushing a... cart, and you were on the cart. You had to sort of guide it through. I want to see if something's possible here. You've returned. What news? Please tell me you've recovered my research. Without my work to focus on, I find myself tending towards darker paths of inquiry. I have your research, but I'm keeping it. That is wonderful news. I'd feared the worst. Not here in this colony, there isn't. Outside Byzantium, life is worthless, without meaning. I must get there. You've returned. What news? Please tell me you've recovered my research. Without my work to focus on, I find myself tending towards darker paths of inquiry. My research? Please tell me you've recovered it. That's... You can't possibly understand the enormity of what you've done for me. And what, pray tell, is the status of our Raptodons? Capital. Excellent. If we're done here, I'd like to get back to work. You understand. I do understand, actually. Actually, there is something else. Um, why do you suppose Auntie Cleo would want to market diet toothpaste to the lower classes? Yes, but that doesn't quite ring true. There's something amiss here. It nags at me like a sore tooth, but I can't for the life of me figure out why. By the architect, this could be a disaster. Why did I not realize that? That would have been enough before, but... You questioning my motives, my compassion, has unsettled me. All I cared about before was Byzantium. I believe getting there was everything. Stream Stalker 2 when it comes out? I didn't even know there was a sequel coming. Um... I don't know. Do you think you're doing? Ah, nothing. Just, just chilling. Sorry to bother you. Repeatedly getting caught. Does not know. Okay, so we can't get the research back. I guess that's fine. What about if I kill you, though? Make him regret it. <laughs> what about if other people kill you first? Nice 
No. I almost died. Because of you? Unacceptable. Reputation decreased? What? Why? What did I do? Well, there's a failed quest. So I guess we don't open up on the townsfolk. Uh, let's reload. <laughs> I love this game. It's cool. You've returned. Please tell The outlaws got away with the research. Hmm. That is wonderful news. I'd feared the worst. Of course they do. Please don't mistake my ambition for callousness. If my colleagues refuse to take their lives seriously, why should I? All they do is complain. They refuse to see the opportunity afforded us here. Believe what you will. But I'm not the manipulative, ego-driven person you think me to be. Mm -hmm. I'm not. Oh, it's you. Wow, his tone has changed. As if my thoughts weren't dark enough already. What is it? I like that. You can't possibly understand the magnitude of this decision. Auntie Cleo will have my head. Leave me be. There's nothing left to be done here. If you're not here to kill me, then leave. All right. Cool. That was that was nice. Now where's uh, Orson? Where's he? I think it's worth more to me if I keep it. We'll sell it later. Uh, nav key from Gladys. We'll be heading back there in a sec. Weapons from the void. Science weapon on Scylla. Any news on the thing we spoke about? You know, that thing. Don't keep me in suspense. Did you get my stuff? I mean, not mine. It's for other parties. Buyers. Talk about money. Lie and keep half here. If you'd set your equipment up properly, it would have yielded more. Interesting. I'll remember that. I'm not the greatest technician. This is going to make me so popular. I mean, with the people who buy it, not by using it. Because I'm not. Only for testing purposes. Quality control. You would, right? Take this. You earned it. If you run into me again after all this is over, maybe I'll have more. Pleasure doing business with you. Do I feel dirty? No? Better days are coming.
I'm buying again, aren't I? I'm such an idiot. Fine. Um, I got twelve grand in the bank. Feels good, man. Feels good. There's one more person I think I need to see here, though. All right, what are we leveling up now? Lockpick all the way, huh? The first item in every lock container, which is free to open, can be stolen without consequence. No shit. Sounds pretty damn good. I mean, if, if I was so inclined to steal things, of course. I mean, obviously, it's not, not who I am. All skills plus five if no companions in party. All skills plus ten if no companions recruited. I think I'm going to go solo. I have to un recruit people somehow and that I think is going to get quite messy I mean you know because I'm going to be letting people down and maybe somewhat cold hearted of me consumable weight reduced 50% that would be nice as well. Although consumables, I'm not really carrying that many of. Durability loss? Eh, that's fine. Whatever. 100% additional ammo stock on vendors. Additional consumable and general stock on vendor vendors. Fast travel when encumbered. Be nice. Time dilation though. Recharge rate increase. 25% extra. Hmm. Five meters interactable highlight range increases the range at which all interactable objects around you highlight without requiring you to look at them directly. Yeah, that kind of sounds pretty good. Oh, I was going to get... God damn it, I'm an idiot. That's fine. Next time. Um, I'll keep it down. Oh, it's literally just the highlight range. Uh, let's load a game. Auto save level fourteen. Try that. That might be too late. Better days are coming. I can smell. No, we're good. Thanks for getting me out of there. Oh, we turned the old lab into storage a long time ago. Anton needed someone to fetch precursors, and when Anton needs someone to fetch something, that someone is invariably me. About being an assistant? No, I suppose I'm not. I know as much about this stuff as Anton does, but I'm treated like a child. You know what it's like? Being shackled despite my potential? Frustrating, that's what. All you do is whine, pal. Um, 
Can I take this poster? No. So I think I still have to see Vaughn, correct? Groundbreaker, Cilia, Orson. Vulcan's hammer, there he is. And maybe we should go to Cilia and just do that one quest and then go back to Groundbreaker. It might be better. Oh, hello. Uh, why do you seem familiar? Have we met? No. I am Orson Shaw, Chief Behavior... Wait. Yes, I'm quite sure we've met. My apologies. Have you retrieved my schematics yet? What a relief. You hold months of work in your hands. Anton would have just given them to Porter without a second thought. What Dial, yes, I, I bought it yesterday. I haven't played any yet, I don't think. I'm not sure exactly. Hmm. Sadly true. Contraband does tend to fetch a high price among the colonies near do wells. So be it. I'll buy them off of you. I might have guessed. Such are the risks when hiring mercenaries. Very well. I have got no ability to stop you. Without those schematics, I'll never be able to repair this pistol. What am I going to do with this useless hunk? No, that was a bad mistake. Oh, I love the autosave system. Uh, where is he? What I'm gonna do... Hand them over. Let him build the weapon. Take the weapon and the schematic. I might just close the door for this one. You guys want to come in? Yeah, come on in. There we go. Why do you seem familiar? Have we met? I have no idea, friend. I am Orson Shaw, Chief Behavior... Wait. Yes, I'm quite sure we've met. My apologies. Have you retrieved my schematics yet? What a relief. You hold months of work in your hands. Anton would have just given them to Porter without a second thought. What a waste of potential that would have been. I see. A proper shakedown. I might have known not to trust a common thug. Fair. So be it. I'll buy them off of you. Much obliged. Here are your bids. Now, let's see here. Attack 100 bucks? Come on. My little pressure and... Voila! I can finally call this little side project complete. Thank the law. Oh. Hmm. I can't be caught with this. You take it. If R&D buys the schematics from me, perhaps I'll get you the first model, hot off the presses. I'll, uh, call you? Yes, I'll call you. I believe we have nothing further to discuss. Hmm, I believe you're mistaken. Hmm. Okay then. Hmm. I believe we have nothing further to discuss. 
You win this round, Orson Shaw, if that's indeed your real name. Time to get the hell out of here, huh? Where's my ship, please? Roseway landing pad. I can travel straight to the interior of my ship. Oh my god, so good. So let's go Cilia real quick, if I can. I can. Destination Silla. What did I say? Cilia. Oh, that was rather Cilia of me. Question. Hey, Captain. I got a thing I want to ask you. It's kind of big. I was thinking about what you said before, after we went to the Lost Hope on the Groundbreaker. I reckon you're right. I think I'm ready to stop fretting and fussing and and ask Junle to go steady straight out. You mean I might not have to eject you? On the ship. Bringing her home to meet the family. No, what about if you went to live with her, though? Ah, oh, that'd be great. Uh, I don't want to crush your feelings, though. <laughs> oh, gosh, do you think so? I just figured, you know, there's nowhere she can go on Groundbreaker where folks don't know her. Here, she can relax. I was kind of hoping you'd offer. The thing is, I can't ask her over like, like this. I mean, look at me. I'm all covered in engine grease and I She's an engineer. I like think she'll be okay. okay. Well, don't look too Shop for cleansing products. I was thinking, hoping. It's turned into Final Fantasy VII all, all over again. I mean, only if you're not busy. Or when you're heading for Groundbreaker for something else. You don't gotta change plans on account of me. Anyhow, next time we dock in Groundbreaker, let me know. Cause I wanna come with. God damn it, that's five five skill points you're gonna cost me. Alright, let's try on someone else. Let's see if I can ditch him. See if it's even an option. Get the hell off my ship. What do you think you're doing on my ship? Hello, Sam. If you go crazy and start shooting stuff, we're going to have problems. Two or C. Two, five, four, seven. Grade rated contaminants. You okay, bud? You're fired. Thank you, customer. This area is... Utterly filthy. Tell me he's not another companion. Did I just... Did I just create another one? God damn it. Alright, this is Parvati's room. There's the danger sign I just picked up before. I don't know how it ended up in here. My ship, my stuff. He has no story elements, but yes. God damn it. I'm, try I'm trying to get rid of people. Let's try with you. Last on, first off, pal. 
I think we should part ways. Boss, you can't be serious. Yep. I thought I was doing real well. Weird planet, huh? Sorry. All right. You don't gotta tell me twice. I literally just did. I'll gather up my personals and uh, get out of your hair. Wow, that was really fast. I'll let him clean the ship first, and then I'll decommission him later. I'm going to take care of Pavati. She's been great to me, and I love to see her really excited about this other girl she met. It makes me really happy. So we're going to help there. You. I find myself marveling Shepard? Uh, Vicar? Of the Fibonacci spiral. I'm sure you know what that's like. Yeah, Fibonacci. Something vexing you, Captain? Big time. Five skill points. I wish I could say I was surprised, but I got the sense we weren't quite getting on as well yeah, as we should. Yeah, shame, hey. Now. I'll pack my belongings and go. Okay. If that's what you're true. Yeah, about. probably for the best, you know. Anyway, I should probably leave you to it. So. All right. I'll be going it alone from here. See you around Halcyon. Maybe. Doubtful. Uh, who was number three? Where the hell did she go? Wait, who was that? There you are. Something on your mind? Yeah, Ellie. You serious? I thought we were getting along just fine. Mm hmm Whatever you say. This was fun while it lasted. Okay. Uh, I gotta leave. Where's the exit? Here we go. Where's Sam? I guess if I decommission him, I can always re... Recommission him later, maybe, if I want. <laughs> Did I see that correctly? I'm at 145. Oh my god, I need another vending machine. There's only one quest I'm here for, though. Uh, weapons from the Void. Yep. It's not going to be that simple, is it? 238. God damn it. Let's get rid of that. That looks nice. That looks actually really dope. Energy. Nice, nice, nice. 220? 220. 44 damage. 53. This must shoot faster. That's fine. You can probably go... Too far. 242. Give me a nice melee weapon. Where'd that flamethrower go? Nah. Two hundred five, one seventy five, one sixty eight. Heavy, the vermin, two hundred five.
I wouldn't mind an electric weapon, hey. Hmm. What about an electric flamethrower? Do you ever think of that? That's a sick looking gun. I like it. Armor. Lockpick plus five. Twenty six, nineteen. Ultimate warrior. Minus five stealth. Well, I don't really care about that, do I? Plus, that's pristine, so it's fine. We'll start selling or breaking down some other junk if we need to. Okay, down we go. Ah, uh, this is why. This is why we're so, uh, hmm. Plasma carbine I might buy back. Yeah. And then all I want is heavy ammo. I think we're good. Two hundred and thirty meters that away. We solo now, so does that mean all of my stats are Yep. Yes they are. Lone Master. Elite troop armor. Minus five on the lockpick. <sighs> oh, it's all stealth skills. Okay. Oh, that's fine for now, I suppose. Look at the size of that thing. Terraformer. Reminds me of something uh, like something out of Destiny 2. God, the number of hours I pumped into Destiny. Those actually feel like wasted hours, now that I think about it. Nah, don't worry about it. Oh shit. You on fire now.
Where's that carbine? Plasma rifle can go. Give me that. That's light ammunition too, or energy? Probably energy. If I can charge it, it's cool. Hmm. They go way over there? Is there a shortcut? No, not without hostiles in between. Yep. What's an outlaw sniper doing standing in the middle of the road? I mean, I don't mean to tell anyone how to do their job, but... That ain't it. Oh, he's having a smoke. Oh boy. Thing's pretty damn ap accurate. Ap accurate? It's accurate. This may just be my new favorite weapon. We'll uh, we'll get some upgrades into that. I think. Maybe even change the rounds to electric? Maybe electric's really good for taking out mechanicals as well. Hmm. You just you just never know. That's a hell of a long way up, my dude. Oh, there's some kind of dome. Okay. Atmosphere dome. Right, because of the atmosphere processing plant. You know, building better worlds and all that. Hello, dying soul. How you doing? I'm having a wonderful night. Doing very well here tonight. Enjoying my time, enjoying my fry yay. Ugh. Guess I'm buying energy cells now, huh? You're from TikTok? Right on, dude. It's great to see you. Everyone from TikTok is welcome here. Um. Unless you're not a very nice person. <laughs> I don't think we need to have that discussion. <laughs> no, 99% of people that visit my channel are, um, are very nice. Very nice people. The clip with the raid. Oh, talking about how I get raids? Gotcha. I know the one you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Confused for a second then. I was like, quit with a raid. We going up? We going up. 
yeah, we get people that come in from time to time and they're, you know, they're embarrassed or... Wait. No, idiot. That's my ship. God damn it. <laughs> Hilarious. Um, you know, maybe they, they're a little bit... Um, worried about the number of people they're bringing in and I'm I always tell them no way like every raid is a good raid doesn't matter the number hey Jackson what's going on man how you doing tonight Man, I, I got completely turned around here. Oh, good. Another vending machine discovered. Very nice. You're one night off this week? Well, make the most of it, my dude. Abandoned mining outpost, 32 meters. Silly old weapon. Sorry, Scylla weapon, my mistake. Mandibular rearranger, sounds fantastic. Still gotta acquire the science weapon on the groundbreaker, interesting. Is this a solo run? Uh, it is now. I. I do have a few people on my ship. They will be leaving me as soon as I've dealt with them. Um, I'm trying to hook up my engineer with the lead engineer on the Groundbreaker. Once that's finished, I will kindly ask them to leave. And uh, I just activated a robot. I'll be deactivating him shortly. So, yeah. Right on, Dying Soul. Thanks for the, uh, for the follow, by the way. Cheers. Good to have you. I think that's it. Now we head back. We are done. Mandibular rearranger. Manufacturer unknown. Worth 750 bucks. Ooh, that is dope. All right, let's head back, hey? Yeah, I'm going to go for uh, Enhanced Stats Solo. I think that's more fun. Um, this is Parvati trying to set her up with another engineer. And then once that's done, she can leave. I don't think it's a good idea to, you know, fraternize on this particular ship. Just I need to get work done. Um, can't give a fuck. Oh, right. 
Yeah, this I do have to bring her with me this time, but... Come on, Sam. You come too. Borst first. Sam is nimble. Look at him go. Groundbreaker weapon upstairs. Hold on a second. Hmm. Jackson, I've been enjoying this very much. Sam, let's try to be a little more subtle, hey? Twelve meters, so close yet so far. Excuse me. All right, we need to find a different way. I love how the game shows you exactly where the item is that you're trying to get. Oh, hold up. Nope, this ain't it either. Creepy when you look at me like that. Is this the way? Somebody's trying to fix this up, but looks like they ain't been here in a long while. This is it. Didn't realize they were outlaws. should really look at the names of the people before I start running in. Repair hanger key card. Prismatic hammer. There you go. That's all the weapons. Do I think I'll play it through to the end? Eventually, yep. Mm hmm.
I already feel overpowered, and it's on normal difficulty, so maybe that's something I need to bump up. I don't know. I'm, I mean, I still get killed every now and again. Back to my ship just yet. of the chairman's children. Care to listen with me? What's that? Speak up now. Why'd you turn up? My stars, what a find. Fine picking like this deserves an equally fine payout. Go on, dearie, and don't spend it all in one place. Ten grand? Because I will spend it all in one place. I think you know how much I'll spend, actually. Pardon me, sweetheart. My old ears must have misheard you. Did you say wrapped it on? Gracious, someone must have hauled them off Monarch. Naughty, naughty. A couple of folks around here might pay a fair few bits for this. Might even be able to start a bidding war. Bless your slippery little fingers. Isn't that just a shame? Prototype schematics go for a fair handful of bits around here. Are you positive? Honest to goodness? Thirty years old with wrinkles, I right? For more, but I suppose it can't be helped. Law bless you for doing the legwork, sweetie. Don't forget your pal Gladys now. You can come visit any time. I think I got just the thing, my dear. A few years back, Auntie Cleo's put out a whole makeover kit. And I snagged a couple for myself. High grade shampoo and conditioner, scrubby brush, a nice lotion, that sort of thing. I still got them too. What's the scrubby brush for? Scrubbing? Cleaning around your nails, sweetheart. Gets the engine grease out, makes your hands soft. Most folk don't got the time, or bathtubs for such, me included. I'll let you have one on clearance. You want rosish? Mock apple and cinnamon, or refurbished ship. We didn't have anything rosish in Edgewater. I heard it smells real pretty, though. I'll just wrap that up for you, since it's for a special occasion. I'll pay for that, ma'am. Thanks for being so helpful. You're welcome, dear. Guess I gotta buy the nav key, huh? God damn it. Fantastic. <clears throat> Do be careful with it, dear, as these keys tend to be a tad hard to acquire. You should have a chat with Lilia Hagen in the sublight offices. She's a dear. You'll love her. Now, was there anything else? I found a handsome ceramic manda pillar at a salvage auction last week. That's by far and away the best weapon we've seen. And it's light magazine too. Light, light ammunition.
I might actually buy that. I mean, it's virtually half price right now, so why not? I'll take it. All right, what are we selling? Junk? What else we got? Tactical shotgun. Mm, pristine, I'll keep it. That can go now. That can go. Armor rating? Yeah. See, I don't think I need any of this stuff. Hey, like... Wait, one. Uh, just sell it. 26, 26. What do these little dots on the left mean? Mods? I don't think so. Screw it. Get rid of them. Don't need it. Lockpick max distance. That I'm going to keep. Medical plus five. I mean, come on. Who am I kidding? Laboratory outfit. I'll never wear it. Used slots for upgrades. Okay. Okay. Long guns I'll keep. Dialogue skills I'll keep, I guess. Temperament? This one was the defective one that we stole. I mean, borrowed from somewhere. Um, and I'll keep that. Okay, that's pretty good. Well, <laughs> I gotta store these somewhere. Jesus. Um, in fact... We find another tech bench we can uh, fix up our weapons. Of which, by the way, this is now my primary. Uh, am I going to retire the old assault rifle? Jeez. This is just too good not to use. Um, or get rid of that. Yeah, that's fine. Nah, this is garbage. Don't even want that. It's heavy. I might as well use use my heavy stuff. Prismatic hammer. Okay. seal of Halcyon Holdings board. Um, if 
only these people weren't in here. You know what I mean? If only they were to disappear or something. Just happen to be looking in the wrong place, goddammit. Yeah, Sam, you gotta stop talking, dude. Okay, what else are we doing here? I think that's pretty much it, huh? Weapons from the void. Search for clues. Hawthorne's terminal mentioned something. Searching black market vendors on Groundbreaker and Fallbrook. Rare items used using such searches. Purchasing old logs or data archives. Okay. Groundbreaker's safe from melting to bits now. Lots of good people can rest easy, Kazoo. Oh, thanks, Captain. I'm gonna put these someplace safe. In her messages, June Lay said her mama used to make this dish for Monarch. Dust back casserole. I ain't buying your recipe. Zeno gold needle mm -mm. And then for dessert, there's a thing called, uh... Sweetheart cake. It's made with almond paste and wax gourds. Now, there's got to be some place in Stellar Bay that can bake a casserole. And I heard tell there's a Rizzo's town near there called Cascadia, what specializes in sweets. Absolutely, surely, Captain. When I got everything all planned out, all I got to do is follow the steps. Then I don't got time to be nervous. Jesus Christ. I just want to run solo, but I feel bad. Can we talk? The fancy soap we got is extra strength. I'm feeling a might ripe. Dust accumulation analysis. Two point five years. All right. Um Shit. Sublight. I think I got a few things to do in here. Oh, neat. They got stuff in here I ain't seen in ages. Scum detected in the... Oh, I know I can dismiss them. Um, but they might as well stick with me for now. Not, I'm not going to skip out on anything. Yet. Welcome to Sublight Salvage and Shipping. A legitimate cool scars, man. Legitimate consumers. You the one flying the unreliable? Miss Lily has been expecting you. I'll unlock the door. So you're the new captain in town. I was hoping you'd make your way to my office. Saves me the work of hunting you down. Is that a threat? Lily Sounds like a threat. CEO and executive director of Aggressive Operations. I'm guessing you already know about Sublight, otherwise you wouldn't have come. Charmed. It's nice to see the unreliable again. A useful ship. Hawthorne was my contractor. I'd recognize that leaky boat of his anywhere. I 
I have a salvage job for someone light on corporate ties with a reliable set of wings. But there's a catch. Just like in the serials. If you have a nav key to Stellar Bay, the job's yours. Interested? One of my guys in Stellar Bay has a lead on some high-grade salvage, but he went dark before he could spill the goods. We arranged a drop at the Saltuna Warehouse's loading dock. Find whatever he left there and take it to Fallbrook. My gal Catherine will be expecting you. Now get going. Catherine will brief you on the details when you check in with her at Fallbrook. One last thing. When you're on the job, keep a pair of eyes in the back of your head. Understood? You'll do fine. Probably nothing to worry about. Probably. I ain't worried if you aren't, Captain. Uh, honest. Such dramatic. Marwal Quinjan. Hello, my friend. Welcome. What do you think you're doing? Nothing. Just don't let me get you again, all right? Guys, you want to get in here so I you don't open the door cuz you have a habit of doing that. We want this weapon here. Where'd that go? It's just a basic plasma cutter. Shame. If you're there and you're there, but I stand here and I save again. <laughs> Caution. All right, relax, relax. It's okay. Things fine. Apparently they didn't like that so much. The Robo Buddy, yeah, we're gonna get rid of them. I'm gonna get rid of all my companions once I help. Actually, if we get rid of. Alright, let's level Parvati again. Um, let's go back to the ship, shall we? And I'm going to deactivate the robot for now. And then we're going to go pick up Arvati's recipe. Buy a dusk back casserole and sweetheart cakes. Stella Bay and Monarch Cascadia. Oh, and... More to the point, I actually want to tinker this bad boy right here. A 
Look at that number climb. Jesus. Yep, that'll do. Let's tinker with this as well. Two twenty eight doesn't even seem worth. What if we modify? What do we got? Mag to zap, an electrical weapon. Legit tempted by that. Um, or more damage. It does just fine damage the way it is right now. Spread, less spread. Extendo sight. Effective range, max range. I'll take less spread on this one. Thousand and fifty six damage. Fuck. That's awesome. Let's store everything else, I reckon, hey? Oh, wait. Armor first. Modify... Shit, I don't know. Stealth skills minus five. Dialogue skills plus five. Wait, if I modify that, toughened, armoring, reactive kinematic shield projector, sure, sounds good, whatever, increases your tech skills, stealth skills, Yeah, that'll cancel out much. Yeah, it's good. Nightingale's step. Volume of footsteps. Walk speed. Geographic scanner. Armor degradation. I'll take uh, walk speed increase. Cool. That's pretty sick armor, actually. And then I'll store everything else. I'm going to get rid of the cam companions because there's a few perks that let me... Or um, well, that gives me more stats better. More stats better. Lockpick plus five. Lockpick max. Let's wear that instead. God, I look terrifying. It's my room up here. Yeah, it is. And there's a locker right here. I wish these didn't have weight.
I think that's about it, huh? Yeah, yeah, we're looking good. Ten percent increased speed feels very fast. Love it. All right, so we're going to where? Sweetheart cakes. I was about to watch the latest episode in Halcyon Helen's thrilling serial adventure. Welcome back, Captain. Now that you have acquired a nav key to Stellar Bay, would you like me to contact Dr. Wells? Well done. You'll love Monarch. Exotic climate. Violence. He was standing by the phone. He was ready to pick up. Culture, really. You'll need to speak with Hiram Blythe. He's known as the information broker, and for good reason. If anyone knows where I can find those chemicals, it's Hiram. I need those chemicals to revive the Hope's colonists. They can help us fight back against the board. They can help us set things right. If we don't put a stop to the board, they're going to drive this colony toward a complete societal collapse. You'll see what I mean when you arrive on Monarch. You'll want to hire the services of a skilled guide. I recommend a hunter by the name of Neoka. I work Which alone, mostly, kinda. Stellar Bay. Very hard to miss. Once you have everything you need, make your way to Hiram Blythe's compound. Best of luck. Everyone on the Hope is counting on you. Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? Certainly, Captain. I was hoping you would ask. was the law forsaken parasites. I had become obsessed. My quest to stop them. To avenge my partner, Philip. And my ex-partner, Bernice. And Lieutenant Jurgen. And those two informants had brought me to Rizzo's distillery. But it wasn't just the triple distilled deliciousness of Rizzo's Spectrum brand vodka that I found there. It was death. I made sure the brain eaters paid the price. But at what cost to me? Can I just say that that is probably the most realistic human I have seen in a video game. This is the Halcyon News Network with breaking news. Halcyon Helen has been murdered. Administrator Ludovico of Rizzo's refused to answer the big question on everyone's mind. Who will Spectrum Vodka's next spokesperson be? Claiming that a special investigation must be concluded first. Captain, we have a communication coming in from one Administrator Ludovico. Get off the transmission, Cedric. We agreed to let me do the negotiating. Law be with you, friend. I am Administrator Ludovico of the famed Eridanos Atmospheric Complex. But there's no need to stand on formality. You may address me as Mr. Her death is the tragedy of our lifetime. As the face of our new product line, her murder is a stain on the Rizzo's brand. She was scheduled to unveil our newest product, Spectrum Brown, before this tragic event. But we cannot move forward with our unveiling until we apprehend the killer. All right, Ludovico, that's enough. You don't know what you're doing. Let me handle this. 
Hm. Captain Hawthorne, so glad to finally have a word with you. I would have been so disappointed if Ludovico monopolized your attention. Cedric Kincannon, Sublight Underground. I'm so glad we're hiring a third-party investigator. No one wants to see a troop of UDL guards stomping all over my hotel. Least of all me. The murder of Halcyon Helen is a heinous assault on this colony. I look forward to watching you find the miscreant responsible and drag them out of the shadows. You're a compassionate person, Captain. And you're right. Halcyon Helen was a talented woman. She had a gift for transforming her art into wealth. You would not believe the money she made us on Dissident Busters. For law's sake, Cedric, could you show a little discretion and not bring up your contraband operations in front of an outsider? Ludovico, you wound me. I'm establishing rapport with our new contractor. Let's not give him the impression that you can't be trusted. Do you really want to do this right now, Cedric? You want to antagonize me while I'm negotiating a contract. Because I promise you, I'll win. We can do this anytime you want. I'll even make an appointment. I'm sure your schedule's wide open. What with your product launch being indefinitely delayed due to unforeseen murder. All right, Cedric. If that's how you want to behave, I have no choice but to file an official reprimand on your permanent record. Oh, please do. I'd love an official reprimand from a failed executive. Could you do me a favor and have it laminated? Could we please stop this nonsense? Captain, I'm Constable Maria Keene. Hiring a third-party investigator was my idea. I've been studying your dossier. You are an extraordinary scientist. If your talents extend to forensics, then you may be exactly what we need. As far as I'm concerned, you're the ideal inspector for this case. I'm pleased to hear that. The future of our complex may depend on your success. I'll leave you in the constable's care. Mr. Kincannon and I must have a word. Fine. Bud Rizzo's is paying for that hotel room. I can't tell you how grateful I am for your help. And even though they may not show their gratitude, I know Administrator Ludovico and Mr. Kincannon appreciate your involvement. Mr. Kincannon could lose his spaceport if board authorities took over the investigation. And if Rizzo's is forced to cancel its unveiling, we might never recover. Helen was more than popular. She gave something to this colony that no product line could ever provide. Real happiness. No one has ever been as well known or as well loved. Uh, outside of our courageous business leaders. Transmission terminated. Captain, we are now cleared to land at the Eridanos Atmospheric Complex. Sounds like more places to steal if you're asking me. Eridanos is a hydrogen helium gas giant, distinguished by a well-defined ring system. The Eridanos atmospheric complex is a system of land masses propelled through a thin layer of the upper atmosphere, where humans are potentially capable of surviving. Hell yeah! All right, let's get uh, this up to 80. Lock picking speed is increased. Find pristine chance item 100%. Delightful. I gotta work on guns, but that can come later. Fine. Ah, I do it every time. So. Additional stock. Time dilation could be really good. Um, kind of useful. Reduces the penalties to accuracy when moving. 
Science weapon damage. 50%. Tend to dialogue skills when you have no companions in your party. Yeah. He's quite a good combat droid, actually, but irrelevant. Did I go anywhere? I haven't even gone anywhere yet. God damn it. Yeah, I don't know um, if if that was sort of. Uh... Forgive me, Captain. I would rather not discuss Alex Hawthorne today. I if she was an, an actual, like if we were watching was there voyeuristically, or if if she's an actor. As you wish, Captain. I must comply with all direct orders. Captain Hawthorne attached 98.4% of the ship's processes to my computer, thereby giving me near total control. I have been programmed to deftly calculate navigation vectors through asteroid fields while also operating our ship's toasters. Alex also taught me the concept of a personality. He was quite delighted when I crafted one in order to better engage with him. It was basic in the beginning. All right, where are we going? Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't want to do that quest yet. Murder on Eridanos. Oh! This is, uh, this is one of the DLC quests. This whole, this whole thing, this murder mystery is a, is a DLC quest. Complete it tonight without stars. And hold up a sec. Okay, I think these yellow ones here may be the other DLC. So we've been doing them without even realizing. Maybe. Well, that's just it. We don't know if that was the murder or if that was just a, a cut. And then it, you know, then it was just yellow story missions. Oh, maybe. But I'm pretty sure this is uh, DLC. Edgewater. Edgewater can't be. No, no, no. These are, these are like base story. Then yellow is that. Quest type. Peril on Gorgon. Murder on errant location region, newest alphabetical quest type. Peril on Gorgon. Hmm. Anyway, we're going to, um, no, these are main quests up here. Anyway, we want to do this first. I want to set her up with the, the engineer, get her off my ship. She's lovely, but I need those extra five points. Warning, dangerous, Cascadia, Stella Bay. We're in orbit over Cascadia, Captain. How dangerous can it be? One point two kilometers away. Okay, well. So we go in there, we pick up a sweetheart cake. All right, Let's see how we go.
This gun's got some some kick, all right. Just gonna have a quick scout around. Nothing too serious. Mega Raptodon. Well, I have to I have to see. Ow. Getting stuck on all sorts of landscape here, Jesus. Oh my god! He was carrying a truckload. The pistol wasn't the best for that. It was doing decent damage, but... That, uh... Energy rifle. It's pretty dope. I mean, we should probably see if there's anything else over here, yeah? Trip Blade Mark II. Oh, oh, what's in... Oh, nothing. Alright, let's go get the Sweetheart Cake. Then probably land at the other site if it's 1.2 kilometers away. My guess is that uh, it's at a different location, different landing spot. Maybe. Can I climb that? You're not going to let me climb that, are you? Nope. Manta Queen! Yes! Oh, you're kind of immune to that. Help, I'm on fire. Like, literally on fire. Please stop being on fire now.
I haven't taken out a Manta Queen before. It's very exciting. Got him. Impact Hammer. After too many encounters with Manta Pillars and Manta Sores, Phobic. Dexterity minus one, perception minus one. No, stop. I'm not going to take any of these. They're just bad news. No sweat, my dude. You take it easy, huh? Thanks for sticking around as long as you did, man. Oh my god, more? Ah, shit. Two of them? Oh my. Oh my. Uh, yeah, we're probably gonna have to. This is why it's dangerous, I guess. Steno. Is that like a named? Yeah, this is why it's dangerous here. Not not friendly. Help. Two named. Oh my god. Run, run. Only got 50 heals left. One down. Two big ones to go and a little one. Let's get rid of him. There we go. Guys are tough as shit, man. Holy mackerel. That was exciting. Sealed. All I want's a cake, dude. Singular. Like, human opponents pale in comparison to that shit. How the hell do I get out of there? If that's sealed, then is it the security office or I gotta I gotta sneak my way around, which is arguably worse. Two other Manta Queens which shoot this type of um damage. I could run past potentially. Doesn't sound very healthy. May have to, dude. May have to. Let's see if there's another way out. There has to be. 
there like a main office here? Security office? Place is no joke. Come in peace, shoot to kill. <laughs> It's not a very well stocked bar. Although, if the town was invaded by giant insects and like scorpion looking things, I assume people would make off with as much as they possibly could. Evac prep procedures, there we go. Birds everywhere, talons everywhere. Oops. Hard. How the hell do I get out? Yeah, it's all connected. It's designed not to let you out. Not this way, at least. I wonder if I can get onto the onto the wall, maybe. Papa Neat raiding, dude. What's up, man? How you doing? It's been a while. Well, that's not true. It hasn't been that long at all. But it's good to see you, my man. Welcome. And uh, welcome on in, everyone visiting. Hello. I could make a jump. I bet you there's an invisible wall up there, though. Betcha. Put money on it. They are billions. Explain that one to me. Zombies, right? Side scrolling like resource management game. <gasps> okay, we can jump off that way. RTS with zombies, yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> Invisible wall, nearly killed me. What the hell? I said you guys were cute originally. That wasn't very cute. God damn. Uh, explain the RTS mechanics. 
Um, like I'm five. <laughs> what game was I playing that people said was like they are billions, but I could not confirm nor deny because I don't know what that game is like. Was it, um, The Last Spell? Reminds you a lot of Warcraft. Okay. Build houses, make workers, farm wooden food. The louder your noise, the more Zs are attracted to the area. Okay. I'll um I'll have to check out your VOD, dude, because I I've heard a lot about it just secondhand from from viewers and and whatever. Um, never seen a playthrough or anything like that. All right, I think I have to go through the two Manta Queens. These things are so freaking tough, man. Did I lure just one? I certainly did not. Damn it. This may be the end. Well, one Manti Queen. Help, oh, I'm on fire again. Stop dropping roll, you idiot. All right, so distance helps with these guys. Ooh. Fire's brutal, yeah, it uh, doesn't mess around. Okay, well, we got past those two. Hopefully, there's not much else in between us and where we need to go. All I want is a fucking cake so I can get this girl off my ship. Honestly, I don't need the cake, but I feel real bad if I just ditched her with no explanation or, you know, at least doing something nice for her beforehand. Where did the two Manta Queens go? I know I melted them, but I want their corpses because... Loot. Killed one back here somewhere, didn't I? That might be one here. There we go. All right, well, I might have lost the corpse, so, oh well. Let's see what else is on the menu. Mantasaur. All right, we're going this way. This giant valley, what? How do I even...
That's got to be certain death. There's no climbing back up once we get there unless that's... Maybe. Maybe I needed to come from the other direction. Maybe this was sealed all along and we can't get through. Well, I'm invested now, so, so be it. Ah, oh, fuck. I mean, the XP is outstanding, no doubt. All just depends on how many health pots I have. <laughs> And even the health pots aren't very effective. My character appears to be having a day. That, <laughs> that he does. And the worst is yet to come. I still have to give the bad news to some people I care very much about. So, you know, I don't feel too good about it on top of that. Dealing with emotional trauma. Yep. Jesus Christ, this place is just non-stop. It's like wall-to-wall -wall badass fucking enemies. Look at the loot they're dropping though, it's ridiculous. They they did give me a warning about this place. I didn't expect to be traveling so far on foot, so that's fun. Actually, you know what? We can probably make it to this place with a, a transport. Go back to the ship, see where else that takes me. Another bad one. Three of them, four of them. Woo! Five of them, cool. Six. Colossus. That's like a granddaddy. Actually, this seems weaker than the... That's what you get, bud. Colossus, my ass. Did you just disappear in front of my face? What? Oh, nice. Back asswards is tough challenge. You think it's going to be easy at first, and then you're like, this sucks, because you start the Mega Stand fight with... I mean, you start with items, but you don't have the stats to go along with the items. Great, now I break my leg. 
Sneak attack, charge shot. Alright. I didn't expect any of those were still alive. Look at the XP though. We are gaining tons and tons of XP. I'm down to 39 heals, which is ridiculous. I did have 60 when I started this quest. Here we go. Road sign. Oh, I feel great now. We're 20% of the way there. My gear must be getting pretty damaged too. Please just let me up. Thank you. Another Colossus. Oh. Tell me I'm not encumbered. No, I'm not. I've gone through about a thousand rounds too. You still don't have Polaroid or negative unlocked? When did you start the game? Are they paying me by the shot? They ain't paying me for shit. This is... So, <laughs> let me tell you why I'm on this mission. I've decided to run solo. I still have a couple of people on my crew um, that I don't really want to run with. If I don't have anyone even on my ship, like if I ask them all to leave... Um, I get an additional five, um, points to all of my stats through perk, right? So there's one of my, uh, one of my people that is on the ship. I care a great deal about her. She's my engineer. It reminds me very much of Kaylee from Firefly. And I'm sure that, uh, that parallel is intentional, by the way. But she's super sweet, and she's fallen in love with this other engineer who's on a, a great big, like, space station thing, right? Um, so we've cleaned her up. She's, she's ready to go out into the world and, and find true love. Um, she's all into this, uh, this other woman. Everything's going great. But she wants to surprise her with a cake. That's why we're on this planet. I haven't even asked her to leave yet because I feel bad. Yeah, that doesn't do a lot of extra damage, really. I mean, it, it does, I guess, but... I 
Got another one? Oh god. Where the hell did it go? How the hell did you get... They're so difficult to see. Alright, we're good. Where am I going? 700 meters that way. Seven hundred meters isn't really even that much when you think about it. Like, yeah, sure, it's almost uh, a kilometer, but still, like, I've run the hundred at school. That's that was my event, and uh, mind you, I never smoked weed, so you know, perfectly legal and everything. A mega manta queen. Ah, oh, Jesus, just what I need. Like, part of me? Yes, we're here for a cake. A cake and some... casserole. Let me see if I can sneak into this building. Rest up a bit, maybe repair. Screw it. How big do these things get? Run. Can't run. Run. Yeah, my armor is almost done and dusted. Probably because of all the corrosion. Are Manta Queens this game's death claws? Well, there's a couple of different um, enemies that are similar in terms of There's the Manta Queens and then like the scorpion looking things. Ah oh, shit, we got another one. Walk back straight up into another pile of them. Ah fuck. Front. I don't even know which way's back now. I'm so screwed. You heal. Who's still chasing? Wrapped it on, that's the other type. I don't think they're related. One's acidic, one is fire. Mega wrapped it on. Oops, see Daisy. Yeah, I'm fighting the two biggest ones that I've ever seen right now, simultaneously. Because that's what we do around here. My weapon's actually damaged as well, that ain't good. I'm hardly putting a dent in this thing. Flora is not helping me fight the fauna. This isn't even the one I'm worried about. It's the other one. Got him. Oh, Jesus. I need help. <sighs> Let's see what we got here.
Oh boy, that damage is cut in half. Let's see. This is actually some decent stuff. 402 DPS. Bolter Pista 2.0, that's why. Uh, that might have to do for now, huh? Revolver Mark II. 314 flat damage? Not bad. 528, that's dropped because it's damaged. 518 for a shotgun. Let's keep that for close encounters. And uh, this guy. All right, let's find that Mega Manta Queen. Let's not let's not jump in the acid pool though. I think that might be dangerous. Reptilian Colossus, another one, not dead, well and truly alive. More like it. Armor is still wrecked. I'm having so much trouble just traversing this garbage landscape. I'd like to see a little bit more fluidity. Oh, you're back up to full health. That's fantastic. Um, a little bit of uh, extra fluidity with walking and, and getting over landscapes and stuff. That'd be nice. just the one right yes so let's see if we can sneak past first i definitely want to take it out but i need help see there's a there's a body down there probably good stuff on the body Yeah! <laughs> Shut up, idiot. I know your leg's broken. It's fine. Okay. Let's sell. Uh, 12 armor, 16 armor, 13 armor. Now I'm wondering if these yellow little sun sigils on the bottom of this is specific to, like, it says Aramid Ballistics, right? Cost of bribes, minus 10%. I don't bribe. I just wave my hand and say, no, you don't need to, you don't need to talk to me about that. It's fine. These are ones just we picked up this thus far. Interesting. Let's buy, um, all of those, because <laughs> I need them, uh, heavy ammo, light ammo, and energy ammo. Oh, I'm not actually breaking my leg, by the way, when I jump down. Like that, it just hurts. Just a bit of ouchy wouchy. I need 150 skill to pick this? That's like top level, why? There's nothing really in there worth... Okay, whatever. I have a skill that lets me see inside uh, containers before I loot them.
Okay, that ain't good. <laughs> Those damage numbers are not... Uh-oh. <laughs> Go around the outside, bud. It's better be the best cake I've ever eaten. Oh, I'm not even eating it! Summoned uh, little swarms. This weapon absolutely sucks for them. Oh shit, did I just accidentally hit another group? I'm so done now. That's it. Slithids turn around. Whatever they're called. Mar Marauder whatever's. Stop trying to hit me and hit me. No, don't. Just stay where you are. Okay, this is slow, but it's working. I'm down to 1,386 bullets. Almost got gotcha. you. Alright, it's not my fault the devs gave you bad AI. Don't blame me. Five thousand seven hundred and seventy five XP. <sighs> Garbage. Not even worth.
too big to fit in fight tight areas, which is why they summon swarms. Yeah, maybe. Okay, this ain't my cake. I'm still going around here. I may end up... Uh, Good. That's another one. Well, comparatively speaking, shouldn't be too bad. Oh no. What a cool little pistol though. Uh, this kill should level me up, actually. Wherever you went. You went around the backside. Fire is brutal, man. Maybe it's time to level my rifles too, huh? Wow, you're tough. You're almost tougher than the, than the last one. Uh, it's fire based, so we cannot set it on fire. The other ones we can though. That's why my little uh, acid weapon should work better against it, but it's so inaccurate it's not worth doing even. Hey, I don't come into your planet and start attacking you. Why are you... Oh, hang on. Let me take back what I just said. Ah, shit. Summoned again. Are you really pulling a pincer move on me right now? God damn, you are. Area of effect is just awful. You know what? I love being on fire. Love it. Joke's on you. It's 
take it back. I hate it. So we can stun them every every now and again. Almost got gotcha. you. This will have to be my last fight, though. I gotta repair my shit. we're going to go for lockpick because that makes total sense one shy of a hundred dang now i don't think we could get into these buildings huh but i did want to see well first things first let's pick up any crap, there was a corpse down here. There it is. Garbage. Seven hundred and ten. We're at we're <laughs> This is literally the halfway mark between the two zones. I cannot believe they wouldn't let me through to get that cake. Chimera. That is a new name. So it could be a more advanced version, which I'm already terrified of. Do we? Okay, maybe we maybe we don't. Seven thousand health. Pretty cut him down a little bit though. Oh, don't get splashed, man. Come over here. Lots of fun going on over here. Head back towards my casserole. Where'd he go? No! He's out of range? You just rubber banded? Not in this game. Come on, man. Biomutant did that to me too. No, if you're not going to fight them fairly, you don't get to fight them at all. Do I have another one of those? Yes, I do. He's stuck. Video games. Never mind. He's free. See, this cuts them down real fast. It's 
Something still alive. Shit was practically invisible. Did it give me a note? Oh, good question. Let's check our quest items. No, it doesn't look like it. Uh -uh. Hero's last stand discovered. All right, where's the hero? It's me. I'm the hero. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. Really? Ah, oh, there he is! Look at that! He's up there on top. Pick up Rapti Don't. Rapti Don't, you say? Ooh! Heavy weapon, energy. Magazine size 40, knockback. Damage type, plasma. Plasma! Alright. Rapti Don't, motherfuckers, let's go! Come on, come closer. I can't hear you over the noise of my mega gun. I take it back, I take it back, I take it back. I like it. I like it a lot. Just let me have my cake. It's not even no it's it's, it's not even like I want to have my cake and eat it too, right? Like I'm going to give it away as soon as I get it. Colossus again. All right. Get out of the shit, man. Get out of the shit. Where did you go? Corrosive weakness, corrosive damage received, plus 25, but I get a perk point. That I will accept. And I want... Science weapon damage. Oh, do I have any science weapons? I don't think that counts. Fifteen percent health restored per kill. Movement penalty to accuracy. Yeah. 
that one. Mega wrapped it on. Oh my god. Hello, Marauder. Sorry this has happened to you. Sorry I'm taking your stuff, etc. Let's, uh, shall we head back? I mean, we're more than halfway there now. Let's head back. Here is La Sand, Sulfur Pits. Oh, that's where we were looping around, right? Vending machine, no workbench, unfortunately. Don't bite the sun. It's such bullshit. I don't buy it. Assault Rifle Ultra. Well, shit. For a grand. That's a significant upgrade. Uh, yeah, I'll take one of those. Alright, let's get back on the ship. To upgrade my stuff and swap some stuff around. Hmm. Yeah, so this is my hiding spot now. I was looking for a place that was quiet. I figured the kitchen would be louder than the hold, so here I am. Cozy like, ain't it? I think it's time you move along. I don't want to get rid of her yet. Got a heart of gold, this queeb. Got a heart of gold. Uh, let's just repair everything. Did we steal the heart of gold? Two shit? Hey Zero, what's up man? Thank you so much for the raid. So we could change this into an energy weapon. I'm gonna run and grab my electricity parts real quick, or all of the parts I guess. Okay, so we're going to go... Yeah, this assault rifle just got left in the dust. Where is Ultra? There's Ultra. Keep you. Keep you for now. And keep you. Okay. I already had one? Wait, that one's got three mod mod slots. Excuse me, what? Barrel magazine site, three three three.
What? I don't understand. It's fine. Either way, it seems I didn't need to spend a thousand on it. So we're going to modify. So that just straight up ups the damage. Whisper quiet, don't care. Crit damage. Nope. It's going to be speedy mate barrel. Could put plasma on this. Oh shit. Effective range. Super Scoper. Extendo Sight. Yeah, just use that. It's fine. All right, let's get off the ship real quick. Sell some more stuff here. Where's the stuff that I have equipped? Oh, it's not available to sell, I guess. Light ammo, energy ammo, heavy ammo, energy. Oh, okay. Then let's change one of these. Yeah, let's change one of these to electric. All right. So many mods, man. Twenty-seven lockpick plus five. That's actually pretty damn good. As is that. I think I'll be wearing both of those. Out of worlds too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it had a really cool trailer. It was like a funny trailer. bring that back. Level 27. Put some mods on it. Bring it back. Pristine. Six. Not good enough. Long guns. Armor three. Not good enough. Not good enough. Not good enough. Yeah, it is Marauder armor, but might be worth
Purpleberry Police. I like it. Sort by DPS if you don't mind. Damage rating, there we go. So these are science weapons. Got it. Hmm. Plasma carbine. That did me well for a while. I don't know if it holds up now though, compared to what else we got. Sword off Mark II. Ultra rifle. Wow, I got tons of them. Why'd I spend a grand on one? Jesus. Light machine gun mark two. What? Nine sixty default. I mean, do I even keep the science weapons at this point? They're kind of crap. It is unique though, that's a shrink ray. All right, so I'm gonna keep that. Uh, we're gonna change up. My Rapti boy, not that good anymore. Light machine gun. I'm gonna go there. I'm gonna change. I might change. Hmm. Hmm. I need those. Need them bad. Okay, back to the ship. Let's keep that. Ah, oh boy, hang on. We can up the damage even further. Just keep this as a heavy. That's my last one, huh? That's fine. This one, let's make this fun times barrel. Critical damage, noise range. Oh, really? Kind of lame. Mag to zap. Let's make this one an electric. Why am I still carrying that? Oh, that's equipped on... Right, got it. Much quieter. 
Tinker, do we want to upgrade? 52. 109. 198. 353. Pretty good. For an LMG, pretty good. How about you? Five levels above your own. Oh, okay. It's level 22. Got it. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Okay. I'm not going to spend any more money. I think I've wasted quite a bit already. Now we're going to store... Wait. Didn't do my armor. Shock armor rating. Physical armor rating. It's fine. Whatever. Ranged weapon skills. Geographic scanner interactable highlight range plus five. Nah, give me walk speed again. Okay. I'll keep maybe a couple of weapons on me just. In case we get low again, although we pick them up so quickly. Um, okay, so transfer. Yes. Science weapons can stay. So I've got ammo, I've got armor kits, weapon kits, lock picks, hacking tools, a couple of extra weapons if we need them, a bit of spare armor if we need it. Okay. I gotta get my engineering up so we don't keep wasting uh, bits and. What the hell? Where's that there? Tell you what, let's go to the other landing I site. A transmission from Roseway for hey, Dr. Shaw. Welcome back, Captain. I have received a transmission from Roseway from a Dr. Shaw. Beginning playback now. What? Oh, is this on? Oh, it's on right now. Oh, blast. Hello? I'm trying to reach the captain of the unreliable. Yeah. I'll keep this short lest I get caught. Please return to Roseway as soon as you can. I have an item of great value that you'll be interested in. Now, how do I... How does this blasted thing turn off? Damn engineers never label these toggles clearly. Is it... Mm. The transmission is complete, Captain. Mm-hmm. Back to Roseway it is, I guess, huh? And then we'll come back to Monarch, land at the other platform, and then see what's up. Roseway, you, you can't offer me an item and then say it's, like, really important or really cool. I'm going to want to take it from you. Where was he? Storage facility?
think this is him. Maybe. No, that ain't it. No quest, just got to get back to him. Where was that dickhead? Rifle's good. Nah, he was in the main town center, I think. Why are these items all restocked here? was in in here no that's not him luxury apartments no he was in like a tool shed or something wasn't he Sweetheart cake. Oh, that's taking me back to my ship. There you are. Ah, I remember you. You must have received my wireless. Thank the law. I went to great risk to send that. Aha. I knew that it enticed you to return to our dangerously unprofitable township. I asked you here because I have a working prototype of the Alti nature, Auntie Cleo's very first weapon. I'd like you to have it before it gets confiscated. The schematics you fetch for me lent themselves well to the creation of the beauty you now possess. Unfortunately, anti-Cleo R&D felt otherwise. The market's already saturated, they said. Weapons are everywhere. They aren't interested in mass-producing the Alti nature, which makes this an illegal prototype weapon. Given your unlawful proclivities, I thought it'd be safest with you. So here we are. I'd rather see it in the hands of a free agent than destroyed. Uh, okay. Thanks. That's weird. Didn't we, like, straight up rip that guy off? I mean, the character in the game ripped that guy off, not us, not not me. I didn't do it. God, this reminds me of... Uh Annihilation, which I just watched. Like, very much. That's the gun. Corrosion. Okay, we don't have a corrosion. Well, we kind of do. 
Level 11. Come on, bruh. Okay, let's try this now. If this gives us access to both of the things we need, well, I don't need to tell you how I'm gonna feel. Went through hell. Possibly shouldn't have jumped down there. Don't think I've seen you around. That means you must be new to Stellar Bay. Can I have a hospital, or please? Here, right? I knew it. See, I made what you call a logical deduction. You must have seen those UDL gunships on your way in. There's always three of them these days. Still, they tend to scare folk off. Wish more folk could say that. Gets awful quiet guarding a landing pad that never gets used. You may not have heard, you being new, but Stellar Bay hardly ever gets awful traffic. Us being cut off by the board and all. Which means I never get to do this part, but I've been practicing, so here goes. On behalf of Monarch Stellar Industries, welcome to Stellar Bay, home of the freshest Sal Tuna and Halcyon. Please state your name for the records. Well... There's one for the logs. I'm even going to give you your own entry code. I'm not supposed to do that. It's against procedure, but Mr. Sanjar isn't so strict about the rules here. Besides, I got a lot of empty entries to fill. Mr. Sanjar will be mighty pleased to meet you. If you see him over at headquarters, maybe you could tell him I did a bang-up job of welcoming you? Oh, and if you're headed that way, maybe you could do me a favor? I got this Rizzo's Rangers Toswell poster coming in on the next sublight shipment, signed by the Black Hole himself. Only I haven't heard anything in a while. Do you think you could check with Celia to see if it's come in? Thanks a bunch. Celia works for Mr. Sanjar in the MSI building next to the bar. She's always there, so you can't miss her. Watch your step if you venture outside the walls. You don't say. A little bit, uh, a little bit dangerous outside, is it? Casserole. Saltuna in brine. I think I'm going to be sick. I clean the apartments while everyone's at work. I've seen all sorts of messes, but this... If you're going into the apartments, do not go into the lower one on the right. That's where the body is. Now, if you'll excuse me, 
I need to go contemplate a hot shower. I definitely will not be going into the bottom one on the right. I am a detective now, after all. You're not supposed to move stuff in a crime scene, right? Asking for a friend. Gotta take my cereal with me, Jesus Christ. <laughs> this poor fella's seen better days. Left field toss ball betting. Well, that's after I get my casserole. Go talk to the chef real quick. Hello, chef. By the stars, my poor heart. I just about pissed my jumpsuit. Get a grip, he says. As if I haven't survived this place for ten years. This town is enough to try anyone's nerves. That was a real popular meal ten, twenty years back. Before the boar tucked tail and ran. These days, everybody's had a belly full of salt tuna. They all want borst, and the mushrooms, well, not many venture out of town, what with the monsters hereabouts. I'm gonna have to I go collect them, aren't I? But it'll cost. Yeah. Here's a menu. Whoa, hold on, I... Okay, okay. Leak contained, my stars. Look, Captain. This is the best I can do without putting myself out of business. I'm mighty glad you reckon so. This is gonna take about an hour in the oven. Nothing I can do to speed it. That's just how cooking works. There we are. Now, if you don't mind, I really need to take a leak. All right, that's half the menu taken care of. Boy, oh boy. This thing's so trash. I mean, I guess it was free. But that's the thing, I don't know if I should keep it or not. Like, is it worth keeping? I don't know. Agnes. Just don't make any trouble for me, okay? Please, will someone help me? My boy's in trouble. Oh, thank you. You're about ready to report me to the to the authorities. Like my little boy isn't at risk of being eaten by some vile creature. You have to help me get my little brother back. He ran away and is going to get himself killed. Oh, I, I just know a raptodon is melting him with acid as we speak. Maybe a big one. Oh, I just knew you were a good person. Agnes, I said, this is the man to save your little Tucky. And I was right. He ran out into the wilderness a few days ago. I warned him about the raptodon, mantisaurs, and marauders with toxic you have no idea. And poisonous plants, but he didn't listen. Please, won't you go and find my boy? Thank you. Oh, I know he'll be safe now that someone's able to fetch him home. You look for him in Amber Heights, you hear? It's down the road southwest of town. I'm sure he made it that far. I just know it. And if you find any of them iconoclasts indoctrinating my boy, you punch them in the mouth. 
Tell them what I think of them luring little boys away from their mamas. Punching. They're gonna bust me if I pick this up. Uh, I didn't think. Well, you probably will. I feel like I've been here before. Some, something tells me. Seems to do the trick just fine. I'm so good at, at lock picking that uh, chests just open themselves for me now. Alright, I guess we're still after... Hopefully everything that we've killed thus far is still killed. Hopefully. Interesting. Why does that building exist? My interest is peaked. Raptophobia. Dexterity, perception, temperament, minus one. No. Like, be reasonable with the stuff. Come on. And do I look like I'm afraid of rap raptor, raptor dudes?
can't wait to see how quickly that takes down a uh what's the other enemy called Murlocs. Whatever they're called. I just wish I knew when stuff was dead. Because I keep wasting ammo. Workbench. Workbench means repairs. What's up, Pixel? How are you? I'm doing great. Having a lovely uh, Saturday morning. Am I still heading south? Shit, I don't even know now. Yes. I wonder if I have a, like a melee attack with my actual weapon. Probably not. Stellar Bay. Wait, is that where we... Wait a goddamn minute. Is that where we came from? No. But traveling through Stellar Bay gets us down on this road. Takes us down this way ish. Oh my god, that's a hike. Well. Stellar Bay it is. Seems like an awfully fast reload for, uh, I mean, I know it's an LMG, but still. This thing's kind of ridiculous. Stellar Bay Ruins discovered. Oh, that's a bit foreboding. Resident. All right, not hostile. There's probably hundreds of quests around this entire zone. But I, I ain't got time yet. I ain't got time. I'm on a mission. It's not to find some kid who's gotten lost. They'll find their way back. Just stick to the road, everything will be fine. Yep, south. 
just follow that break right at the junction maybe actually break left i don't know if this is a bridge here or not God damn it, you couldn't just leave it alone, could you? Ow. Damn. I think I don't see you in your sniper rifle there. Thanks, boys. Did I get that? Yes. Shit. Bitter. Run. I just rather not fight them anymore, you know? I think I've fought enough. Okay, so it says right through to Cascadia, which may be. No, that's gotta be it. If that's Cascadia landing pad, that's gotta be it. Nineteen heals. Oh, yeah. Stun Baton Ultra. It's fine. What did I just sell before that though? Dead Eye Assault Rifle. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, let me grab some more ammo as well, just to be on the safe side. Cascadia this way? Yep. Great, more bad dudes. Don't stand next to the explosive barrel, dude.
This gun is primo. Very good. So this is the junction where we want to head left. Yes. Oh, why am I tempted to go look up there? God damn it. Buildings. The Marauder Outpost. All right, no big. So something over here. Stick to the road, he says. It'll be fun, he says. I want to go left here. Yeah, a couple of raptodons. Come on closer. the great thing about this gun it's so subtle that nobody knows i'm here it's fantastic i did see a corpse somewhere didn't i yeah false hammer Weapon is too good. We're having a much easier time going this way. Mind you, we are, what, four levels above where we were when we started the quest? So, not horrible. Albrook Crossroads. Let's quickly go over here. If we can discover, discover Fallbrook, so we can fast travel back, maybe. I'm sure that counted anyway. It's fine. The maps are huge here, like, they've done an amazing job, and it, some areas feel empty, but it's not too bad. Come on, bud. I'll wait for you here. No sweat. Three thousand three hundred and six bullets left. Where'd he you go? You hiding? Son, you hiding? Why are you hiding? Or Lorne Crossroads. All right, so we've got to head through here, turn right, then left. And we're home. We get our snack, and we, we out of there. Is 
guys are a little bit more resilient. Oh, what the hell? Have you tried not being on fire? Alright, where are we at here? Lockpick. Almost maxed. Skilled. Hmm. Quiet weapons deal more damage. Well, this certainly isn't one of those. Movement speed. Health restored per kill. I can go with that. So there's science weapon damage times two. Alright, anyway, Cascadia is where we're headed. Goons! Marauder goons! Hunting rifle. I still wouldn't mind another hunting rifle, hey, like a proper one. Discover this little township first. Yay, nay. Oh, restricted access. Borst factory. And you guys have a ton of defenses too. Hmm. Okay, never mind. So drone. Like, yeah, I'm I'm super impressed with how big this zone is, hey. Hey bud. Ow. You literally set me on fire. Why would you do that? I 
have a feeling that scrap mechanical was actually on my side or at least not attacking me oh well too little too late God, we're so close. I can smell the sweetheart cake already. This is not going how I had planned. Speaking as though I had a plan, I did not have a plan. Damn it. Of course. Oh yeah, that's working well. like fighting those things in Diablo 2. The swarms. I hate, hated them. Wow. Jibbed. Two hundred meters, we're so close. You saw nothing. That's Cascadia right there. God, we made it, boys. Let's go. Tell me I can get in here. Ha <laughs> Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Scared the shit out of me. That's it. All in a line.
I was about to give up then. But uh, turns out, all I had to do was break in or walk around the corner. Now this place has seen better days. Marauder ringleader. Good. First thing I'm going to do is freaking unlock the front door. Well, no, let's go get the let's go get the recipe first, I guess. in combat <laughs> oh boy that nobody's ripped off the vending machines. It's so wild. Let's see if we can actually, I mean, I should be able to fast travel back either way, but I want to still unlock the front door because the front door and me, we have, uh, we have concerns. Northern gate open. There's my ship. Somewhere. Where's my ship? I cannot fast travel whilst near hostels. Oh, okay. No problem. Oh, my ship's not here. Right, right, right. I have to do the remote call thing. That was fast. Hey, 
Hey boss, I think we need an animation for the landing of the ship. Psh. Animation for the landing of the ship. Who do you think you are? Um. Animation project team lead, sir. Get out of my office. I want to check this out first though. Holy cow. Friendly? He's sleeping. He's fine. Chocolate bar. Mechanical sentries. Herbert. Food service mechanical. Herbert, you have a red bar above your head, friend. Yeah, you don't like me being here, do you? I like your outfit, Herbert. That doesn't seem to be doing much to you, friend. But we could have been friends, like proper friends. Herbert was the best of us. Gotta be honest, maybe I would have done the same thing. Hunting Rifle Ultra. Interesting. That's Herbert's leg. Sorry, Herbert. Cow slept through all of that. It's Herbert's arm. I don't know how that got there. No, it wasn't me. Gotta be more going on here. What's happening? Jesus. Okay, take it back. Herbert was, uh, wasn't doing so well. I love his armor, though. Well, in memory of Herbert, I shall now leave this place. Oh! No kidding.
All right, let's get the hell out of here. Let's go set the other two up on their date. I'm a, I'm, I'm a, I'm done with this planet. I mean, there's plenty still to do. We'll be back, but for now. Wait, what? How did he... There's a workbench in here. 150 again! Still grinding? <laughs> I don't know if to feel sorry for you or... Uh, happy for you. One sixty three DPS. I mean, whoa, what is that? The candy cane. Why is the damage so low, though? And it's level seventeen. That doesn't make any sense. Doesn't make any sense at all. Sell that. Sugar Ops Armor. Rizzo Corporate Armor. Forty one. Thirty-eight on a helmet. Iconoclast. What? I mean, I got it, right? That's dope. Oh, yeah. Candy badass. Where's that workbench? Uh, actually, hang on. Where was it? There it is. So we need 150 lockpick to get through there. We'll get there soon enough. We're we're doing well on levels. We're gaining them pretty quick. And then nothing will stand in my way. Except sleep. I gotta go to sleep. Uh, let's go talk to 
Kaylee, and then uh, kick her off the ship. We'll set him up first. Set him up first, and then kick her off the ship. The dust back casserole Mr. Raymond made smells incredible. Oh, I kind of want to take a little taste, but I'm going to be strong. Now look how cute these cakes from Cascadia are. Someone even traced little hearts in them. Do you oh, know I guess that settles dinner. what I went through to get them? Creation, Captain. Well, I was gonna, but then it hit me. I got this nice meal all planned out with music, and I got that soap to scrub up with, but... I don't got nothing nice to wear, Captain. You're an engineer. I don't have a head for fashion, and I can't really picture myself in something clean and pretty. There's this place I heard of in Byzantium, Jolliker's Haberdashery. I bet I could find something nigh on perfect at a place like that. Thanks, Captain. I know I've been asking a lot, but you help me out every time. You're the best. Mm -hmm. What the hell is Byzantium? I don't even have a I don't even have a map to Byzantium. I don't even know where Byzantium is. Wait, Byzantium is a shit. Hang on. Hang on. Haberdashier in Byzantium. Is Byzantium a planet I see no green symbol right now How to travel to Byzantium. Go talk to Gladys aboard the Groundbreaker once Udom. Okay, so we got some work to do. I uh, It's something we need to unlock, apparently. Uh, and I ain't doing that tonight. I am damn tired. Chat, I've had a blast. Thank you very much. It's been fun. Uh, I also have to figure out why my screen looks as orange as it does. Can't she order a dress online? <laughs> uh, you've been great, guys. I'm going to see you tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to end the stream right now. I am, I am beat. Take it easy. Uh, love you lots and talk to you soon. Bye-bye.